YouTube, hello! Welcome back to Bug Snacks. Heidi ho! How you doing? Indeed. Ah, uh, we're trying to get everyone back in town. It's Philbo. Oh, hey, buddy! I'm glad you're here. Uh, I've been talking to the other not the Hobbit. And, uh, I think they could use your help. Nathan, thanks by the way for the 46 stuff, months, but, almost four you know, years. Good lord. Uh, personal issues. Oh, they're dick. Got it. It can be hard dealing with your problems alone, you know? I'm. That's what I'm if saying. Talk to, to a doctor. It'd mean a lot if you could help the others. God, it's... You're fine just being food? That wears off, right? That's like... That'll go away on its own. Okay, well... Catch one sweet frighter. Oh, is that for, um... Actually, who is that for? It's been a week and I played this for one day. I need to remember all my controls. Okay, yeah. So, Triffany, oh, that's his wife. She's out in the desert. I think we saw her for a moment. Uh, I gotta get you two pop sticks. I don't know where they are. Uh, Lizbert's the main thing. I feel like that's kind of a background one. Just come fry with me is to catch a sweet frider to keep Cromdo quiet. Because he's making demands, I guess. So, I need a sweet frider. I mean, I have a frider. I don't think I have a sweet frider, per se. Top of the stream is cut off. Maybe you're cut off. You ever think of that? But right you are. Hold on. Uh, oh, mouse, please. Just work with me. Uh, uh, it's working. That's more or less good enough. Okay. Ahem. <laughs> Waylord just occasionally slipping back in under the chat. A battle royal! Oh, Saints Row the Third is done again. I, in my gaming ventures, finished Fallout 3! I'm currently working on the DLCs. I've already done um, Operation Anchorage, which is... Do that one really early in the game. Pro tip. Um, you get free power armor for it, and it's it never breaks. Like, ever. It might, I think it's an oversight, but it's, like, super busted. And I've done Broken Steel because I beat Fallout 3, so obviously I did Broken Steel. Ignore that. That's Rosa. Uh, oh, currently right. working on Mothership Zeta. It's good to be home, stranger. Feels like a fresh start. If you're ever fixing to grow a farm yourself, here's something that ought to help you. I never want to grow a farm, actually. Uh, hey, Bestie, thanks for convincing me to come back. I forgot how nice it is to have a real bed. Well, since I'm not camping out anymore, you can borrow my old sleeping bag if you want. Enjoy, Bethica. Ah, Bethica. And Sam Regal. No one panic? Why would anyone panic? You're gonna punch a boulder? Ah, RE5. Classic. Uh, thank you again for helping me and my little ones get a better home. I sent a lantern in case you get real scared. Also, get real scared of dark. Charwee, Joey, and Ashwee send their love. They can keep it, actually. Gramble. A uh, bot one? Oh, pff, oh, crazy. Oh, and it's Philbo. Hey, buddy, I noticed you've been sleeping on the airship. I have. Uh, do you like your new hut? Oh, do you not like your new hut? It's fine. I'm sure you're just used to your old bed. Well, don't worry. I made another one just like it. Hey. Maybe I like airships, you son of a bitch. Hey, bestie, I know. Jesus Christ, how much mail have I got? I know you love doing me favors, so could you help me get my bag back? I lost some trees near my cave. Ugh, what's in it? How did I lose it? Find it. Maybe I'll tell you. God sakes. Huh? Jesus Christ. I saw a snack the other day that I loved on site and was hoping could add it to my barn. I don't know what it's called, but it looked like a big heart flying in the sky. Fuck it. All right. If I find a big heart flying in the sky, and I guess I'll look for Bethika's bag. God, the... We calling him Sam for the rest of it? Oh, Sam Regal? I was going to refer to him by his proper name, Sam Regal. Shishka bugs running about. Don't remember there being mail in the game I played. Wonder if they added it in a later update. Eh, maybe. It seems like there's jobs to do in there, though. Maybe you were just bad at looking at the mailbox. Ever think of that? But, uh, no, at the very least, a, a, a complaint I continue to have, really my only complaint so far, um, is that... Phew. Hey, what's up, buddy? What's the... There you are. Crispy snack pod. Once found, it's easy to pick up. 
Oh yeah, so it is. Look at that. Snack pod. Snack pod. Um, my only real complaint is that there's not a mini map. This game screams. It was added with the Isle of Bug Snacks update. Ah, this game screams objective marker or mini map to remind you where the exits are. Shut up, computer. Uh, it doesn't have that, and it's ridiculously frustrating because I'm bad at directions and, like, knowing where objectives are. And I'm like, bruh, please, a mini-map. My kingdom for any sort of fucking thing to tell me where I am that doesn't involve me popping open this and, like... <coughs> Excuse me. Cheeto dust. No, Cheeto's nothing shrewd. Oh, look who it is. There. Yeah, I'll do it. That means you missed, uh, Pokemon, uh, Ranger. Fake fan. Missing Pokemon Ranger. Unbelievable. So these are Friders. Are they sweet Friders? They're just Friders. They're not sweet Friders. That's just a candy patch. She lost a bag in the trees? Like, I'm looking around in these trees, and I'm not seeing a bag or anything. Did it even update in my, um, Pokemon College? It didn't even update in my, uh... Wow, I don't even know where it is. It's just... There's a letter. Huh. Alright, well, fuck it then. Uh, me a Sweet Frider and Pop Sticks, which I have no idea. I, I think that, yeah, Trek to the Desert. Okay, so they are in the desert. I saw Triffany in the last stream. I remember that. I didn't talk with her because I was kind of doing a thing with, um... Fucking Cromdo or whatever his name is. The, uh... Hey, I'm walking here, bug snack guy. Or... What are they? They're bug snacks. What are these creatures called? Who's Nathan? Nah, don't worry about it. I hear, uh... He's been unbanned, though. Ah, another fine day behind us. Okay. Hey, uh... Hello. Uh, your, this isn't your ranch. Here's your ranch. It was like, I'll at least huck a fucking, uh, bug snack in. You can have this, uh... You can have this barbecue bunger. And, uh... Oh, he's a... Oh, does he upgrade at, like, six? Well, then have them all, buddy. Have them all. There's a... S the size of your heart has grown, and so is your inventory space. Oh, okay. Not a bad trade. And now we've got a bunger in town. Matt Mercer's gonna be in the new Dragon Age? I think he was in the previous Dragon Age. Ah, <sighs> another fine day behind us. You said that already, you son of a bitch! Oh, now he has a new mission for... Oh, it's getting more bug snacks, I bet it is. Hey! Oh, no, it's just turning it in. So cute! Thank you so much. You're welcome, Sam Hopefully Regal. Hopefully, my little ones will settle down. Maybe I can even start training them again. You're a shrewd negotiator. Ah. Like a campfire. God's fucking. I wanted to ban that. <clears throat> I wanted to ban the word birthday, but I didn't have time before the stream started because I had technical issues, as usual. But it was different technical issues, so they took me longer. Twenty-six months, though. Thank you so much. Good seeing you, Ellie. Heard your stream went well when I raided. I, uh... I was out doing a personal thing, uh, your next stream, so I missed it. Mercer was only in the anime Dragon Age? Oh, that's right. Token's birthday? No, it's not. Hey, Tim, what's up? Tim, do you know what's special about today? Fucking nothing! So I need pop sticks and sweet friders. You're a white cheese. Oh, you're a sweet frider, ain't you? Yeah. Now, how do I get over there? Oh, didn't I get a? Uh, hold on. Yes, I have a launch pad. <laughs> Does it tell me how I? Uh... Oh, I aim it. I see. Then I aim it. That's right. And then launch! What the fuck happened? You fucking 
worthless sack. What other Sam Regal games can we do? Uh, he's all over Fallout New Vegas. He and Liam O'Brien. Gee, I wonder if I'll come back to this later for some reason. How do I... Hold on. How do I get... Fucking... Just retrieve it. I don't care. Why do I keep putting the fucking camera away? I don't... What is ha... Oh, I'm backing up into cacti. What the fuck is this wind? What is happening? I'm trying to take a fucking... Why does he keep putting the camera away? Unbelievable. All right, so how do I get this Frider? Can I just... No, it's not that simple. I can't even jump. What the hell? I can't... What is happening? I can't jump? I can't use my camera? What is going on? You love ketchup, right? You're a fryder after all. An on-screen celebration. Hell yeah. Wind? I don't know. It is blowing me, like, very slowly, but, like... Yeah, and enjoy that. I forget what I have to do. Hold on. I can probably open up my book. What do... Fryder. What do Frider like? Loves ketchup. Uh, I forget what exactly I need to look up for it. Uh, birthday hype for me? No, you don't need that. Or you could not do that. We're in the hype, boys? No, there's no... Why? There's no hype. Jesus. Ugh. Scorched Gorge. I don't understand what is happening. I can't jump at all. I can't open my camera. I can sprint. How do I deal with you? You seem to be freaking out as well. Do I like... Hold on. If I do... Uh... I think I want the snack trap. So deploy that. There it go. Okay, so it is windy here. Let me guess. Now that I've done this, I can jump again? Yeah. What the fuck was happening? Is that a cliff like I'm technically not allowed up on because I'm too good of a gamer? And they weren't prepared for me getting up there? 7-9 with a gifted sub, ya shrewd son of a bitch. Thank you so much. And then you said Beetlejuice three times from Tim. Old? Well, I would be if it were my birthday, but it's not my birthday, so. When can we hype? Oh, my actual birthday. There's an actual hype train going? Yeah, I have nothing prepared for hype trains, so. Thanks very much. Love you all. Love the hype train. It's not my birthday. But I appreciate you being hyped for my not birthday. Okay, thank you. I guess I'll just... up. Uh, that's... 500 bits from Ellie. You know what that means. Ellie, a game request for you. I wonder if the problem... How the fuck do I get this Frider? Hey, asshole, how do I get this Frider? I want a Frider, but it's on this ridiculously tall rock. And I wasn't exactly blessed with still Real legs. birthday hype? Yeah, in like four months. Okay, so he said it's on a tall rock, suggesting I do have to get up there. Is the problem I crashed into the windmill and started it up? That would be kind of funny if it was the case. Yeah, but I can't jump up here. It's maddening. 
Uh, how do I get you right before you get back? Okay, so if I just place you there... Ha! Uh, seven nine with another gifted sub! With audio that does not exactly suggest I'm free of this hell, but... Hey, what do I know? The ketchup goes right away. Like, you're covering... I don't understand how to get this guy. Oregon Trail, you got it. And we'll add it to the list. I have to assume I can't get him, because I have no idea how the fuck to get that guy. And nothing I'm doing is even, like... On that lip, I can't walk properly. I'm constantly moving. I can't jump. He's freaking out. I have to assume that there's some other one I'm supposed to find, and that one is just like, nah, son. It's too heckin' windy. Oregon Trail? Yes, I saw that. I am I will play the Oregon Trail. Is it allowed to be any version of the Oregon Trail, or do you want, like, the classic Oregon Trail? From, like, 1984 or whatever. You launch a trap at the Frider. Uh, I don't think that's right. How can we do an Oregon Trail playthrough? Well, it's easy. Uh, I boot up the Oregon Trail and click stream. It's, it's actually a ridiculously streamlined process. Yeah, I, I would think you understand that's how it works for the most part. You literally told me how to get the street fight. S street fighter. <laughs> Yo, fuck the sweet fighter. Where's Ryu? Where's Ken? I mean, the street fighter. Listen, a lot's happening in chat, Nathan, and I'm trying to play the game at the same time. So you forgive me if I missed a message. This fucking guy. Expecting me to read. Use worry seed on Skidoo? Yeah, that's probably what he said, too. Fucking, you get the Friday by shoving it up your butt and using worry seed on Skidoo and losing a Nuzlocke. Thanks again, Nathan. We all remember. It's what Ellie said. I told him he doubted. Oh, I have to launch a trap at him? But the wind. All right, whatever. I'll give it a shot. If it works, great. If it fails, I get to yell at Nathan. For the fighting game. Yeah, Street Fighter, obviously. There's got to be, like, a joke Street Fighter out there. How do I... Uh, why can, can I get close enough with the, uh... I mean, surely I must. So if I put this here... Deploy. Uh-huh. And then I grab you. Deploy. Alright, now... We aim... We aim... We aim... We aim... We aim. Okay, apparently the... The game didn't like me thinking I aim after I put something on it. I know. No one's ever loaded a gun and then aimed it before. That would be insane. All right. Aim. There we go. Put it right in its path. Now then. The trap. Put it right there. Now then. Launch. I should also have that. I missed, but it did turn green. It did turn green, so... Yes, there's God. Street Fighter 2010. Which one's Street Fighter 2010? The timing is key. Oh, yeah. Jealous of Beetlejuice Fanta Haunted Apple Soda. That sounds disgusting. Apple Soda? The NES one. Oh. I asked the question, remembered, and hoped you meant a different one. I guess I could always do Street Fighter the movie, the game. That's kind of a dumb meme. I need to launch you first. Oh, it knocked you out of the fucking sky. Excellent. Oh, shit. Now I gotta get over there. Launch me! That didn't work at all. Fuck me running. Uh, can I just retrieve this way? Nah, worth a shot. Okay. Well, that's an issue. That's kind of an issue, actually. Well, a part of me at this point wants to, uh... 
knock that thing out of the sky and catch it as well. Alright, so there you go. And... There we go, now it fell off. Plus ratio. Mine. Did you fire the movie of the game? Yeah, that's a good one. Street Fighter the movie of the game is pretty ridiculous. Jean-Claude Van Damme literally had in his contract for them to use the likeness in the game that he was the best character. And he was! Seems like I can just do this for what it's worth. Uh... Come on. Launch! Activate! I kept going into the menu to swap. It's way more easy than I was making it. The game knows there's like a... Uh, a certain order to things and how I might want to do them. Alright, alright. Some assembly required. Buy your own risk. All sales final. Offer void where prohibited. Insurers insured. Optional. Hell yeah, brother. It's got a story mode. Ooh, street. What's SVR 2009? We got fries. We do have fries. I was going to look up SVR. I don't know what that is. 2009. Kirby Squeak Squad. Ooh, the thing of that is I've already played it. SVR 2009. No! You and wrestling games, man. 3D fighting games like that are just awkward and weird to play, dude. That's not due to the fault necessarily of the... Genre, it's more that the the WWE games fucking suck to play. That's why I let the computer just beat people up for me. Guarantee's not guaranteed. Huh. They can say nuts or shellfish. It's a bridge, you idiot. But yeah, that's why I let the computers do it, because I'm bad at those games and they're just awkward to play. But watching the computer fight each other is really fun and I enjoy it. We gotta do parent stuff. Uh, we love you, have a good stream. Thank you, thank you. Anyway, uh, let's eat. I got you a sweet Frider. Frider. It has John Cena's army friend, Tony. That's crazy. See my previous statement. Me bad at game like that. Let computer do cause funny. Hubba, hubba. Okay, you're a little too aroused by toes Imagine or french this. fries. One or the other. Hey, you're my best and only customer. I'm starting to think I should get a better location back in Snacksburg. Yeah, maybe. But uh, moving all this inventory across the desert is real sweaty work. I'll need a way to keep cool. Fuck you. If you make both my feet into big bopsicles. Bopsicles. Uh, then walking the hot sands would be a breeze. But I gotta warn you, you won't find bopsicles in the desert. Bopsicles. Better look elsewhere, pal. <laughs> Sounds like filthy. He is a little Danny DeVito-ish. Hey. I need bopsicles. All right, where was the, um... Yeah, there you are. Also, I gotta... Hold on. What did she want? The, uh... The pop star woman? The Elton John-looking motherfucker? Wiggle. Eh. Pop sticks. Or pop ticks. Uh... I have to trek to the desert to find them. All right. I don't know what a pop tick is, but... Is it you? You're a Scorpenio. Which I think is a Pokemon, actually. Pop tick. I don't even know if those fly or not. Is the problem. I'm just doing like a quick survey. I know I ran away from Trip Kill like an idiot. Is this just more chocolate or ketchup? Oh, it's hot sauce. Looks like that. Makes sense. It's in the desert. What are you? Oh, you're on fire. Hey, you're Scorpio. All right. Jeez, I get it. Oh wait, what are you? Oh, pop ticks. Well, you're kind of a tiny little thing. Can I just put a trap down and have that be the end of it? Fucking, are you serious? You're an asshole. You know that? Don't you give me that face. You're an asshole. Uh, this fucking guy. I think I might throw the trap at him and see if that knocks him into the water. I suspect him in the water will, uh... 
Or I could. Hold on. He loves, I don't know what that is, but he hates hot sauce. Lobs fiery peppers that you think catches attention. Hmm. Uh, there was Hercules game on PS1. Yeah, I seem to recall that. It was uh, not great. Hell of an hour and a half and two CVSs this evening. You must really like CVS. That's about a fire sale. It's on fire, it's for sale. Ah, thanks, Cromdo. You always know what to say. This thing won't shut the fuck up. Oh, it's like popcorn now. Yeah, fire it, fire at me. Huh. I thought pop tick like a popsicle, but it's popcorn. Anyway, let me try launching. Boy, you. Aim at him. Now let's try. Eh. Eh. Kinda, kinda hope that would knock it into the water. It did not. What if I hit it with its own leg? I got hot sauce. What if I hit you with hot sauce? That enrage you? No, clearly it wants me to hit pop with this hot sauce. They just jumped in the water. Damn you! Still not a birthday. Crash bash, huh? That's a one stream game. Are you 100% sure you want that one? Because it is one stream and then I will never play it again. It is going right to the top of the not playing that list. Not even a full completion, a one stream game and then it's gone forever. And then I don't publish it on YouTube just to spite you. Speaking of things spiting me. Eh, no, please. Just let me catch one of you. I don't care what you are. No! Ah, oh, you bastard. They hit each other too. All right, well, I've actually already grabbed one of you, so it doesn't matter. Crash 3 is already on there. Maybe I'll do it, uh, make you... <laughs> Maybe what I'll subject you to is the co-op of that off stream mm. on like a uh, fucking parsec or something that I'd be more amicable to anyway hello yes oh goodness huh. I didn't notice you there hi how are ya I'm hi how are blog. ya lot of blag archaeology <laughs> try not to step on the skulls ya yeah? I do what I want you want me to come back to Snacksburg gosh look around ya how about There's Crash Team Racing the Adventure Mode? Sure. Here, and I barely dug one hole. Is that the PS2 but one? Crash Team I Racing? I could use a trip to the old research tent once I get a few samples. See these skeletons? Something's fossilized in their stomachs. Looks a bit like a local bug snack. I'll need some live ribblepeeds. Ribblepeeds? Could you help me find some? PS1. They like to hide on the walls in these here ruins. <laughs> Nitro card on PS2. Oh yeah, I was thinking it was the one where you can like hmm. absorb other cars with people. You specifically want the PS1 version, not hmm. the remake. Okay. Fill her holes to convince her to come back. Oh. All right. Okay. Don't don't, don't say that to Seven Nine suggestion. These guys look an awful lot like us. What are we, Grumpuses? It's just these are a lot of dead things. Anyway, you need ribapedes. I gotta get pop ticks and ribapedes. Oh. Likes to hide and sit still. Maybe some sauce could get it to move. Ooh. What, well, wait, what is it love? Hold on. Loves hot sauce? Well, that's convenient. I think I have just two hot sauces left. All right, but what if I, not you. What if I were to put this right here? Mm, yes, yes, yes. And then some dashingly handsome man were to do that. Ha 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 ha! No hot sauce for you, Ribblepeed. Still though, you need three? 
And I still gotta get two pop ticks. I don't understand how I get pop ticks. Probably has to do with that fucking awful Scorpenio. What do you need? They're too small to catch in a trap, but maybe some heat will puff them up. Okay, so yes, I do need him to... I might want to refill on hot sauce if I can. Yes, Bunger, hello. Gotta drive home? How are you watching me not already home, you mad woman? He's so proud of himself, that Bunger. The bad one? Was that one bad? I played a bit of that when I was a kid. I thought it was alright. Reminded me a bit of Crash Team Racing, but... Or Crash Team Racing. Uh, Jack X Combat Racing. But, uh... You know, it was less fun, because, uh... The load screens were abysmal. I remember that. Alright, so I need to... Yeah, you want to hit that one? Puff it up! Okay, so now... Let me get the other one. Okay, so now that they're puffed up, the question is... Can I just slap this here? Don't burn my trap, you whore! Ah! Rude! Alright, deploy it there. Don't burn my trap, you troglodyte whore! Ugh. If I put it there... Are you for real? Are you for real? Give me that. Ah, for God's sakes! I despise you. How am I meant to catch you? Lobs anything catches its attention. But how the hell do it loves whatever that is? Is that honey? Is that cheese? What is that? I feel like I need to put it out with something, but I don't have just, like, water or anything to launch at it. Troglodyte had to be permitted. Uh, what Ratchet game would be next? Well, the second one, so going Commando, right? Yeah, obviously. Can I just run up and grab you? No, it's not that simple. Damn. Okay, well, what if I were to do... First of all, let me grab you. So I can have you have your uh, your walk cycle out. And then it was like, oh man, that's too close, never mind. Aw oh, man, you gotta be fucking kidding me. What is your problem? I'm never gonna catch this thing. I make you hate yourself. No, I need. I, I'm never gonna catch these things. Because Corbinio just sucks dick. There was one that went through water. Maybe I can leave my fucking uh, trap in that one. Yeah, along here. So, if I just leave my trap here, I need these things to attack first. Yeah, that one works. The problem is I need them to not run in. They do not fear me, for I cannot catch them. All right, I'll take it, you fucking asshole. Anyway, I need to hit them with hot sauce in the, uh, the somewhat vain hope that he'll light them on fire and they won't just run into the water immediately. You're the worst and I hate you. You're the worst and I hate you. You're the 
worse than I hate you. I also gotta find these Ripplers or whatever they are. Yeah, you smell like hot sauce. Bet you wanna... Alright, well that got one of them. So I'll just place you here. And there he comes. Now I hide back here. Waiting, biding my time. The little one's obviously not going to get in there. But the bigger one... Nailed it. Come to daddy. Alright, let's just repeat that. Boy, this right. No! Get it, get it, get it, get it! Oh, you bastard! I had it! You! You stupid whore. Okay, well, catching him while he was on fire also did it, so I can't blame him. I guess I can't blame that one on him. Put... go out! Ugh. Whatever. Great, I've got your path. I'm just gonna post up here and wait. Jesus Christ. Get out of hell? I played that on YouTube ages ago. I might be willing to do that. Might be one to do with a co-op partner, though. Get a collaboration going. It's a real Nathan sort of thing to play. Saints Row 2? Eh. It's so annoyingly difficult to do co-op in that at this point that I don't want to bother. <laughs> that game, I mean, if Dead Rising can get a remaster, uh, Saints Row 2 can, but that game is begging for a remaster. Mega Man 6. Just OG Mega Man? Sure, why not? I will be using flagrant save stating, but... Nico, up fine. The Xbox not that long ago. That's true. That's true. Number one, thanks for outing me like that, you dickhead. Number two, don't you not have Game Pass anymore, making co-op very difficult? You know, since you need Game Pass, this fucking bug snack is like Nathan. Annoying me right now. Like, get out. What are you doing? Other than pissing me off. Haven't canceled it yet. You're right. I'm definitely going to get on that Saints Row 2 playthrough. Lickety split. Plenty of time. Sonic Battle. That's, that's, I've never even heard of that one. There's not more to it than Sonic Battle. Oh, is that the Sonic fighting game? Like the 3D one that was in arcades and shit? Alright, let's see. I need more ribs. And they appear to just hang out on walls. Alright, what do I... Was it hot sauce they liked? Uh, first of all, let me get your... Okay, and I can place you right there. Then a little bit of hot sauce right now. Yes, come and get him, ribs, you fool. Oh, shit. Uh, Alright, nailed it. Definitely the first try. Don't worry about it. I need more hot sauce. No, that's Sonic Fighters. Okay. Then I don't know what Sonic Battle is. Alright, well, next time I'm back in town, I've got the pop ticks, at least. Took some finagling for those pop ticks, but I got them. So, if two of the three ribs were in here, the last one... There you are. And Fuckface wanted, what is it, Bopsicles? I have no idea how I get those. Or where I'm supposed to get them from. 
Probably somewhere cold, since he said he, uh... You won't find them in the desert, and they need to be cold. Oh, he's shy. Go for it. Yeah, you get your fucking hot sauce, you freak. Thank you. It's a Game Boy Advance fighting game, and there's a plot. No words have made me more disgusted than Game Boy Advance fighting game, because it makes me think of Street Fighter Advance. Hmm. The Game Boy Advance was not advanced or complex enough to handle the nuances of a fighting game. DS was barely, and it had to implement a touchscreen, which meant it wasn't. 3DS wasn't. But yeah, sure. Maybe I can do a one stream of that. Oh. You could blow into the DS, worth it. You can't do that on emulator, as far as I know. Anyway, do I need to feed you? I do you, this freak wants to eat them in order to understand Ribblepeeds. Ribblepeeds. All right. God, it's like it was cut off. It goes ribble and then gets eaten. Oh. All right, and I'm Ribble. thinking, thinking, thinking about your left hand. Ooh. Now you got ribs for hands. Ooh. Smash 3DS was fine. Curious. It was. Only look like they have bones. Functional. Wishy all the way through. Ew. So what did these fellas eat then? The 3DS well, couldn't handle like the Grandma fucking ice said, climbers, dude. If you want answers, dig through their sock drawer. What? I want to get into that dwelling over there, but the door's blocked up. Sure is. If you could do something to get that door open, they'd be real swell. Yeah, unless a bunger can. Pff, we got a sandstorm coming in. Unless a bunger can do something about it, it ain't happening. Break open the entrance to the ruins. There is this thing. Conveniently located next to it. Uh, remind me, what do you like? Let's catch him, catch him, catch him, eh? Hmm. Aw, oh, man. Bet you want a bit of that action, right? Wow, that's really all it took, huh? Mine now, idiot. Spuddy. Spuddy. Hmm. All right, let's see. These Asian people worshipped the pizza moth. They might have been cats. Uh, yeah, I don't know what's going on there. But yeah, no, I'd be willing to do Sonic Fighter, I guess, but do not expect good things from it, because it's a fighting game on the Game Boy Advance. Maybe I'm maybe I'm being negative. Maybe I'll be pleasantly surprised by a fighting mm. game on the Game Boy Advance, but I... Uh, well, I mean, Dragon Ball Advance was really good, and that had fighting mm. game elements to it. Maybe I... You know what? I'll keep an open mind. Oh. I'll keep an open mind. Oh, you're too kind. Meet me inside. Saints Row 2 is no, because I played that recently. I don't have any interest in playing it again. Uh, I would have to play it co-op even if, and Nathan's canceling his Xbox subscription, and I don't care about doing it with anyone else. And most importantly, I already said no, so. Also, the PC version doesn't work with co-op, so. Also, the game controls like ass. I was trying to avoid saying that one. Don't be negative on your birthday. True. The game controls like ass, but like a, a pleasurable ass. The one you like looking at. Check it out. These murals are still preserved. As far as I knew, we were the first grumps to settle this island. But here we got a thousand years of history unaccounted for. Generations of grumpuses who hunted and ate bug snacks. Just a cosmic reminder that nothing really lasts, eh? Hmm, what's this? Looks like there's a hidden chamber somewhere in the canyon. That's what you got Did from that? Where they stored bug snacks? Would you mind? Why would they need to chamber? store them? They're all over if the fucking island. There, please bring them to me. They're all over the island. They're <sighs> okay. Are you just gonna keep hanging out here? Or are you actually going back to Snackopolis or whatever? Snackville. Bug Snacksburg. God damn you. I'm trying to get everyone home. All right, where's the other one? Where would the other one be? Fuck you. Probably this way. Follow the arrows, after all. 
Oh, this is back to Snacksburg. All right, sure. I got uh, I got the pop ticks after all for uh, the woman on the beach. So might as well go for that. How you doing? Uh, yep. Yeah. yeah, I'll donate Spuddy and a white cheap. Making sure I keep the uh, pop ticks because it'd be a real me thing to do to accidentally uh, donate bug deal. ticks. What are you oh, doing? Hi. You just watching me sleep? What is this? My house? Whose house is this? This is absolutely my house. What are you doing in my house? Mm, bug snacks are toast. Am I? Wait, am I the Later. asshole? Whose house is this? Oh, this is Lisbert and Agabel. What are you all doing outside their house? Hey. Weirdos. Whatever, off to the beach. Maybe getting her back will uh, open up a new area. I also have no idea where she is. I think she's over... There she is. I going to say, I think she's over here. What is going on here? Crabble? Anyway... Let's eat! Uh, oh, right, you can have... Yeah, you have things going on in your head. Uh... Horn, you say? Oh, God! Your horrible, horrible arm. Oh, I'm so sorry. I look ridiculous. You do! I don't have a single new tune in my head. What a woeful journey I've taken. Darling, I apologize for putting you through such an ordeal. It was all for the sake of art. And art is priceless. I can see that this simply isn't working, and I believe I know why. Oh, not nearly enough. The name of the game! Though it pains me to return Had to do it once. Single, I shall face the music and greet my adoring fans. Aloha, darling. That means hello or goodbye. Alright, so Wiggle's going back to Bug Snacks. Excellent, excellent. Which leaves me to just find and enter the hidden ruin. Which I assume is somewhere in the desert. So I'll keep looking around there. I got a letter, probably from, uh. Yeah. Tch. Looks like my token of appreciation from earlier. Uh. Oh, I got hanging lights. Oh, they added. Right. Stuff you could put in your, uh, house. Woo! Gramble, dear. Gramble. Are you free for a little stargazing tonight? Uh, sorry. I can't. I gotta watch my little ones. Uh, of course you do. Come on, Gramble. Surely you can take a night off. Nobody's desperate enough to steal from you. Anymore? Maybe. But even still, my kin might wander off if I'm not here. Oh, oh, Sam Regal. It's only natural, dear. I'm sure they long to return to the wild. Uh, don't say that. This is their home. They they love it here. They just get lost sometimes is all. Ugh, whatever you say, darling. Let me know if you're ever free. Bro, she just wants the gra the, the the Grambly D, if you know what I'm saying. He doesn't know what I'm saying, actually. He's very innocent that way. Anyway, let me load up on, uh, sauces here. Excellent. <laughs> the googly eyes. Excellent, excellent. Anyway, hello! What's going on? Hello! Wiggle, I'd, I'd love to... Hello! What it... Hello! Hello!
Hey, Wiggle, what's going on? Time for an interview. I'm no stranger to interviews, darling. Hit me with your best shot. All right, let's get started. Uh, first of all, standard procedure, why are you here? Or, who are you? You've certainly heard my number one single, Do the Wiggle. Oh, uh, yes, of course. Uh, it was a little weird that it had all that racism in it, and then when it started getting popular, you changed it, a la Black Eyed Peas and Taylor Swift. But you know what? It is catchy. You see, Wiggle Wigglebottom needs no introduction, darling. All right, then. Why come to Snacktooth Island? Well, I'm here to gorge myself on a new life experience. To get my creative juices flowing, as it were. Uh, so your juice isn't flowing. That's a personal question. Oh, well. You know, no hit can stay on top forever. And I'm afraid the audience didn't care for Wiggles World or Wiggle Baby one more time, and I've been accused of being a one-hit Wiggle. No. Thoughts on bug snakes? Every taste is like a star going supernova inside my mouth. Creative energy like I've never felt before. Bug snacks are worth whatever price I have to pay, darling. And what price is that exactly? Bug snacks are forbidden fruits, darling. <gasps> Gasp! I believe something exists to keep us from them. She yeah, it's called for me Bramble. One day, oh. But not before I dazzle the world once more. I see. And why did you leave town? That's simple. I was following Gramble. Ah. He certainly knows his way around snacks. Was that an innuendo or? No! Goodness, no. I love Gramble. I would never. He's far too sweet. Like a little strabby. No, I would never take advantage of him, no matter how easy it would be. Right. Ah, Lisbert. She and Egabel were big fans of mine. You know, I met them backstage at my first farewell tour. They didn't have passes, mind you. Liz climbed in through the air ducts. Oh. <laughs> but if somebody breaks the law out of love for my music, who am I to turn them away? That, that's a little sketch. Does that happen a lot? Not nearly as often as I'd like. All right, well then. <gasps> that night, when Liz went missing, I ran into the woods looking for her. But instead, I found something terrifying. Towering over the tree. What's happening? Oh, I got the, the pop star queen back. Queen of bug snacks. Her screech was deafening, and I ran for my life. I see. So the bug snacks have a queen. Well, I can't be sure. Progressive. All I saw was a menacing silhouette. But if Liz crossed paths with that, that. Thing, then I fear for her. Well, thanks. That's a wrap. Ah, I feel the warm glow of free publicity. Okay. I know my story about the Queen sounds far-fetched, but I swear on my platinum record it's true. If you don't believe me, go and see for yourself. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got music to make Wiggle gave you a map to Liz's last location check your journal for details all right good stuff I do at the very least uh got a new area out of it Cromdo yeah he is the cold feet thing history lesson is definitely the one I need to be looking into uh what is the map that she gave me uh this is not helpful interviews and return grumps to grump snacks. I'm even halfway done. Good lord. Uh, yeah, I have no idea. It's like, here's a map, and then I don't know what I'm looking for. This is the same couple places I've been. Can I just... Oh, I can fast travel. That's handy. Very handy indeed. Anyway, 
I need to find... Is it like an item I would have to like, interact with in my thing? Hold on. No, it would be in my backpack otherwise. Oh wait, no, here it is. Saw this brute looking down on camp from between the trees beneath the snow line. There's a snow line? Sugar Pine Woods map. I don't fully grasp what I'm looking at. That was Sugar Pine Woods. It's gonna have to go back to your normal CVS tomorrow. Good lord. So much CVS. Guys think Intellect Color might have a second job secretly. Just love CVS so much. Alright, so where is. Oh, the other cave is probably across the bridge, you fucking son of a bitch. Maybe? I don't know. Uh, there was a cave over there. We definitely uh, already opened, however. Uh, that's back to Bug Snacks. Snacksburg. Um. Oh, wait, there it is. Here's the other. Well, it's a door I can open up. Uh. Hey, uh, buddy. Huh? Catch up on the door. Come to the ketchup. And then go to the ketchup on the door. You fucking... Ketchup on the door! What do I, Olay Toro you? What are we doing here? <sighs> Don't fucking... No! Go to the ketchup, you stupid animal. Unbelievable. You're not helping the situation, you absolute bell end. Okay, yep. Yeah. Go that way. And then to the door. There we go. Mine now, idiot. Spaddy. What do we have here? Weenie worm, a shy weenie worm. That's what I have, a lazy little worm. It's only motivated by its hatred for ketchup. Interesting. So do I get to crash into something with this ketchup-based hatred? Like if I do, hold on. If I do this. Wow, he really dodged it, huh? Oh, wow. I feel like it got bigger. And it's, I mean, it's aggressive, but like... Do I, do I fling it at that point? Or do I like, oh, I bet I know what I do with it. First of all, uh... There, you're washed off. Go away. Lunatic, I tell you. I bet what I do is put this right here, slather you in ketchup, get their attention, hello boys, oh yeah, a bit of this action, huh? Oh, I want them to fall and like duck into the hole. Okay, so they only do something if they're covered. Gotcha. Does that include if I, like, leave this spring right here? Boy! Nice, nah, totally fine. I don't suppose I could just... It's not as simple as that, is it? He just walks into the fucking trap. That means absolutely nothing else? Yeah, no. Why would it? What do you mean? 
Oh, yeah, I can just, he can, I so overthought that. What do you mean? Fucking. Token, overthinking it. If you have a bingo card, that would be on there. Where's Lizbird? Oi. Feed her a shy weenie worm. I need to feed another man's wife a shy weenie worm? Yo, this game's on something, I tell you. Sometimes it's simple as throwing the trap down. Yeah, so it is. Isn't that nifty? No, it's not. It's horrifying. Hmm. The taste is a little off. I'm wondering how long those snacks were in there. Did you find anything else in the chamber? A uh, massive trap pit and lots of corpses. Hmm, that's a little intense for an ancient storage shed. You know, that just might have been a burial chamber. But if that's where they put their dead, why are all these bones out in the open? Hmm, well, I gotta solve this mystery. Uh, Sorry, but I won't be going back to Snacksburg. You trollop. But what about Wambus, the man who loves you and not a cactus? If Wambus wants me back, well, he can come out here and tell me himself. <sighs> You might have heard things haven't been too good between us. Triff. I keep telling myself I'll get around to c and but it's just easier to, uh, stay out here with the bone. Triff, he's replaced you with a cactus. He's dressed... I cannot emphasize this enough. He's dressed a cactus to look like you. Oh, my sweet dear. I guess the big love really misses me. Well, I miss him too, but I'm still mad. A cactus. God, time would help, but time's just pushing me closer to the grave, and I'm not feeling any better. I suppose I could try being among the living for a while. All right, there she goes. Well, now I need to figure out this, uh, me well, I guess I gotta interview her first. And then I figure out this, uh, this clue. Or map, I guess, that um, Wiggle gave me. There must be another exit somewhere in town. I also like that the loading screen features more and more unique uh, Grumpuses as they come back to Bug Snacks. That's cool. Or Snacksburg. Oh, had to come by and pick up supplies. Is that a new garden you got there? Yep. Are you gonna stay for long? Well, that oh, you got this protein pancakes, hell yeah. Reason for me to stick around? Don't blow it. Man, Triffy, I'm sorry. He said I'm what he needed to. Oh. Yep. It's, it's true. I can't grow Men are stupid. Desert. Yeah, and you got a lot of growing to do. I wasn't going to give up my dig site either. Not we may have different goals sometime. It's like a five minute walk. That doesn't mean we're not together. I guess I could leave my farm every now and again. Yeah, just go see each other. Uh, maybe even lend a helping paw. What the? You better. Th now give me a kiss, you hot dish. Whatever, they're happy. Mm. Welcome home, Triffy. Let's hope the cactus doesn't get jealous. What's that now? Nothing. Yo, three-way with cactus? Let's go. All right. Uh Oh. Lots of people got things for me to do all of a sudden. Hey. Hey, hey. I'm not you. I'm trying to. There we go. Interview. Oh, sure. Sounds like a real hoot. Uh, by the way, Befka's taking photos of your ass. We move inside here. So let's start with the easy one. Who are you? Oh, I go digging up bits of history and try to piece them back together. It's usually not so dramatic. Just an old coin or a severed toe under a rock. But this island's chock full of finds. And, um, your name? Oh, goodness, my name. I'm Triffany Ladablog. Triffany Ladablog. I heard about the trip to Snack Tooth and thought, well, I could keep scraping at odds and ends till the day I die. Or I could really get out there. Try following in Grandma's footsteps. Who is Grandma? You might have heard of Bronica, Ladablog. Oh, of An course. An adventuring type just like Lisbert. 
her. She filled up our old house with relics and sketches, taught me to love history. Bless her heart. Thoughts on bug snacks, the name of the game. Tell you a joke. All right, hold Amazing, on. Amazing, don't you think? We got paintings of bug snacks from a thousand years ago. Thousands of Grumpus years ago. Grumpus civilization rises, collapses, and turns to dust. But the bug snacks, they always stay. They are walking records of history. That's interesting. But, and this is part of the interview, I want to make this very clear. Ahem. Ted's grandma pulls him aside at his eighth birthday party. How relevant. And hands him a and hands the boy a five dollar bill. Here, this is a little something extra from Grandma, but not a word of this to your brothers and sisters. The boy looks at the bill and responds, "If you want me to stay quiet, it's gonna cast you a little more." Savvy kid, I like him. Anyway, why'd you leave town? It's less I left and more I stopped coming back. I wasn't even there when the fight broke out. Imagine me coming home to find Wambus all red in the face and at Gramble's throat. And already banging a cactus. No, no, nothing so simple as that. I wanted him to come with me to the ruins, honest. But he wouldn't give up his farm, not even for me. <laughs> Stubborn fool. You guys were a five minute walk away from each other. You probably could have shouted and heard each other. It's not... Why did either of you need to go any and give up anything? Ugh, whatever. Lovely gal, that, that was a boring joke. All right, here's a better one. Look in the time. mirror. And when we were, we'd usually be in the medical tent, getting caught by Agabelle. We'd swap stories about what we found and show off our grisliest scars. What happened? To, oh, you two got injured that often? Adventuring is a dangerous business. Archaeology less so. But the Lada Blog method can be unconventional. Bug the heck out of Agabel. She never liked to see anyone hurt. Least of all, Liz. And what happened to Liz? You know, out here, it's only a matter of time before you fall in a hole or get wedged in a crevice. Mm. Especially with all these earthquakes shifting the geography around. Mm. Not to be morbid. But it could be a thousand years before somebody finds where Lisbert wound up. That's extremely morbid. Oh, you're too kind. I'm just happy to chip in and solve a mystery or two. Speaking of mysteries. Oh, good. You want me to run an errand for you? You betcha. Lisbert stashed a journal in the ruins for safekeeping. I can't get it open without damaging whatever's inside. I'm thinking you might have better luck with it. Why? Anywho, I've nearly talked your ear off. Better get back to work, eh? Jeremy's journal, or has a locked journal. I need a key to open it. All right, well, interesting. All right, so I think your story, the rest of your quests. Hello. Hello. Need something? If you're not busy, darling, I could use a helping paw. It seems like your run-of-the-mill bug snacks aren't getting my creative juices flowing. I need something, oh, spectacular. I overheard Wambus talking about a sandopede, a snack made of many pieces working in harmony. That may be just what I need. All right, I'll ask him about it. Yellow submarine. Catch two sub sandipedes. Said you heard Wambus talking about it? Wamby! Hey, how's it going? Let's chat. Stranger, I won't mince words. Thanks for bringing Triffy home. I don't know. Okay, well. I don't know Bye -bye. where, um. The, uh. I don't know where I find sub sandipedes. Oh, bestie! I was just looking for you. Now that Wiggle's back, Snacksburg is finally interesting again. I'm in the mood for some snacking and snooping. But like, everybody here gets all quiet when I'm around. It's back where you first met Wambus. They oh, okay. trust you. That makes sense. Right, bestie? So here's what I'm thinking. You dig up dirt on Wiggle and share it with me. And maybe I'll tell you something good in return. Hmm. I don't want to. 
But you do now have a picture of my dick for blackmail, so I'm forced to agree. At midnight? Oh, for God's sake. I'm gonna go look for a fucking sub sandwich, then. At midnight. It's 7 a.m. Wait, what? I should took out a camera, and my dick's out. Like, I'm not wearing pants. My dick's out. Just whipped out her camera. Bitch has got me. Oh boy, yeah! You see the situation I'm in. Is that bug snacks down there? Or, I keep calling the town bug snacks. I think that's Snackburg down there. You can kind of see like uh, the houses and my uh, crashed airship a little bit. Anyway, where did I first meet Wambus? I think it was over here. Yeah, here's his old makeshift farm. Are these anything? Nah, I wasn't growing anything worthwhile. They did have this. Hello. Strabbies. Pinkles. I love that it's just a jar of pinkles. Jammed in the dirt. Are you what I'm looking for? Now you're a weenie worm. Weenie worm. As flavor falls, isn't right? Unless it is! I have no idea. Uh, can I, like, hold on, can I, it tells me, right, where, like, some bug snacks are. Did it just walk past me while I was reading that book? It sure did, yep. <laughs> Ranch dressing? No! I wanted the sandwich! There we go. Anyway. Uh, that is... That's a sando piece. Is that what she wants? Because she said she wanted a sub sando piece. Sando piece. It's meaty and aggressive, just like I like my women, am I right? The middle parts of the subs. Oh, I see. All right. Remember watching Jeremy play this game years ago uh, when it first came out and he hated Befka and gave her enough hot dogs to the point she was entirely a hot dog? Wow. Harsh. Did he look at her and go, hot dog? Alright, I can tell already, because it's in a bunch of little pieces, I want to, like, activate this and have it explode. That's, well, I say I can tell already. Let me not jump to conclusions, but I assume that's what it's going to want me to do. Here it comes. Explode! Ah, uh, you dang fool. Oh. That didn't work. Okay. I will admit, that surprised me. Did get a Steam achievement for it, though, which is interesting. Ah! Oh! Oh, yeah, the middle pieces are subs. Hold on. Separate bug snacks work together like a sandwich. They're separate bug snacks. Oh, you know what? Maybe I need to, like, catch it when it's separated. I did... I assumed it would be stunned and I could run up and grab it. Maybe I gotta put the net down and then. Hold on, maybe I like go like this. Deploy you here. And then aim you so you land over there. Let's see if that trap works, eh? Whoa, hey! It might have, it just... I forgot to... Hmm. I forgot to do the thing where I, uh... Switched to my, uh... My trap so that it could grab them. Okay. Trying this again. Once more with feeling. You're going right there. You... are gonna launch right into the trap. I'll hit the button. Swap to my actual trap, and then, wahey! 
Nope, none of that. Okay. I do not know what you want from me. Offer hint if requested. For God's sake. Well, that was frustrating. Hmm. They are silly to listen to. Uh, maybe I'll send you in there. What do I know? I could probably grab that by uh, putting up a net around near the uh, the exit, but that doesn't seem to have to do anything with the uh, the sandopede. Hmm. How would I try hitting it with a ranch? I guess. Oh, it's Pinkles. Whoop ha! It was in the water when I did that. And it just washes off. Making caramelized pearl onions. Ooh, I bounce on it. That's kind of cool. Huh, is there, a, like, a big thing to stun it, maybe? Let me grab you real quick so I have your path. Glad the confidence respawned so fast. Hmm. I feel like it's definitely... This to an extent. Do I maybe need to, like, really spread them out and grab them when they're not? Oh, he just goes and gets it. Perhaps my problem was that the, uh, boy, I'm running out of ideas. My problem was that I put the, uh, maybe I need to catch the head. What do I know? Maybe that's my issue. Like a pokey, once the head is, uh, caught. Well, that was embarrassing. Completely missed the head. It's a skill issue. Maybe uh, your face is a skill issue. Ever think of that? Alright. Uh, uh, put you there. There. Oh, for God's sakes! Whatever, I'll wait for it to come back around. I'm gonna try and get the head to launch. To, uh, try and get because I keep aiming for the body. Maybe if I get the head to launch, like a pokey in Mario, it'll then uh, affect the rest of it. Whoop! -ha! That did not work. See, I don't just want to try that again if that's not the right answer, but I thought I saw it turn, like, blue there for a second. Hmm. Have I caught any of you? I have some grappled away. Oh, I might mean, for that. All right, I'm gonna try this uh, launch pad thing one more time. Specifically, launching the head. 
add a net. But only the head. But the rest of the body is confused as shit. Alright, get the snoop root or whatever it is. Well, that was the sandwich in the head, but... God damn you all! What secrets have you? What a leader. Does anybody else get the urge to follow it around? Yeah, so it wants me to grab the leader is the problem. I imagine I can lure it away with mayo. But what would I lure it to? <sighs> I'm not getting this at all. All right, what am, what are what am I missing here? Me it later makes it super easy, but if a coin can get now by the flying olive attacking it. Oh. It does say it latches on to snacks uh, with a substantially long tongue. Right. But, like, I don't have the thing it loves, though, eh? It loves, like, some weird yellow sauce I don't have. I got it. Molly Wop. What's your opinion on olives? Disgusting. Anyway, well, I'm sure they're not that important. Sounds like it's a for later problem good opinion we actually agree on. I mean, they're exactly the same as pickles. They're just disgusting things swimming in vinegar. All I am is consistent. Vinegar equal bad. Olives and pickles the same. Swimming in vinegar, therefore bad. Her fake diary. Yep, turns out to be a fake. Ah, the old fake diary gag. Olives not brined, they're in salt water, uh, not salty vinegar. It sounds like you're making excuses. It sounds like both are equally disgusting and gross, but one you were indoctrinated in when you were young and you're too embarrassed to admit you don't like them now. The other one you had when you were older and realized the truth, the horrible truth. Anyway, I think I can wait until midnight. I forget how I do that. Oh, that's just the weather bullet. Damn. Okay, maybe I go to a bed. And I can at least wait till midnight. You didn't like pickles for most of your childhood? Oh, I see. Then you, I'm guessing, fell and hit your head? And something got screwed up and now you like pickles. Uh, sleep until midnight. I'm going to keep sleeping in the airship because I like airships, okay? Now let's find Wiggle's secret, hmm? Don't mind me, just going about my business. What are you up to, you son of a bitch? Salt and vinegar with any, pretty much anything is good. Uh, no, salt by itself is fine. As soon as you add vinegar, it becomes uh, disgusting and awful and bad. What are you doing? Sprout! Huh? Oh, it's 
just a bad dream. Come on, Queeble. Don't be shy. Come on, come on. Wiggle needs a midnight snack. I don't think Grambus would appreciate that. <gasps> Darling! What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Uh, well, I'm just looking to spend some time with Gramble. Alone. Yeah, I don't believe you. Poor guy sleepwalks. <laughs> How he sleeps all curled up like that. That's pretty funny. Hello, darling. The exit's this way. Yeah, and I'll just shut the door for you. Don't worry about it. Yeah, mm-hmm. Aloha! I'll just watch you go. Yeah, there it is. All right, let's find Befica. That's Wambus and Tiffany. Or Triffany, excuse me. Aww. Well, they're adorable. At least they have a bed big enough for them, you know? Unlike Grampus, who has to sleep all cuddled up with himself. But he's sleeping in a loft, which is pretty rad. Pretty based. That's Wiggle. Uh, where is Bethany? Lizbert. Uh, Wambus. Is this Triffany? Fuck, Bafika. Keep thinking this bitch's name should be Tiffany, so it becomes Triffany. It's photos with her and uh, some people. Kind of cute, actually. God damn it, I was just looking around your room while you got up. Hey, wake up again. Wake up again. There you go. Have you heard of the Tiffany problem? No, I have not. OMG! Sounds like Wiggle has a nasty habit. <laughs> I feel bad for Gramble. Those two just aren't gonna last. In my old life, I would have killed to get dirt on Wiggle Wigglebottom. Uh, I used to take pictures for GMZ, you know. Oh, of course you did. Whoever else might be buying. Uh, wait, who else is buying? That's all you get to know. Client confidentiality. But I'll tell you. Did she have an only grumps? Have you found any snack pods yet? A grumpsly? They're the best snack ever because they don't even move. But they're a little hard to find if you aren't observant like me. Yeah, I found them. There might be some hiding by my old cave. And I know a certain grumpus who might want some. Oh well, this is embarrassing, because I already found the one near your cave and gave it to uh Ramble, you see. And here it is. There you go, your little packet of snacks. Well, maybe there's another one that spawned in. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to wait until I find another one. Hey, oh wow, oh. Uh, evidence of a snack pod. It seems like it won't reappear until all five snack pods in the area have been caught. Okay, so there are five in the area. Well, I can take a look then, right? So Lord knows I didn't grab all five. I think I grabbed one in the other map where the sandwiches are uh, giving me hell. Or I grabbed another one that was like... In here, maybe? I... Oh, well, there's one. There you go. Snack pod. I like how that one... It's clearly they just had a woman go up to the microphone and go, Snack pod. The others are like an effort was made, you know. Bunger, 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 bunger. Shishkabug. Snack pod. Name Tiffany dates back to like the 13th century and was often used for babies born around the Epiphany. 
Epiphany's more a thing that happens to you when you realize something, not so much an event as far as I know, but okay. But if you name a character Tiffany in a historic novel, it would pull people out of the story because it feels so modern. I mean, I guess. I think if I saw Tiffany in a novel, I'd be fine. But maybe I'm just built hey different there, and more tolerant going? of other people than, say, you, for example. Anyway, uh, let's eat. Got you a snack pod. Your leg is a snack pod. Can't say I miss that cave, but I do miss these. Thanks, bestie. Is that it? I guess it is. Goodbye. Okay, bye. Yo, hey, what's up? I'm hoping to get new items from you. You've got that party look. Snacksburg is looking pretty busy tonight. Hell Seems yeah. Like a great time to gather everybody around the old campfire. And sing our campfire song, our C-A-M-P-F-I-R-E-S-O-N-G song. And if you don't think I can sing it faster, then you're wrong, but it'll help if you just sing along. Enjoy that deep cut. Uh, nothing like a campfire, eh, buddies? Beat sitting in the dark. I tell you, there's some spooky stuff out there. Yeah. <laughs> there ain't nothing out there. Just bug snacks and trees. You're just yellow. He's clearly I'm pink. I'm not yellow. I'm pink. Thank you. Like, obviously. There's something stalking me. Watching me from the shadows. Epiphany's the end of the Christmas night. season. No, that's I New see Year's. I see something similar up on Idiot. top of the canyon. Real curious. You celebrate some of the I showed up at the Visit Jesus. Darling. There are no animals here. He was born None Christmas, please. the beginning of Christmas. Oh, I, uh, for God's sake. I sakes. too saw the thing. Can we talk about something else? You know, the desert grumps, I can look around. they had some odd rituals. God, I wish I was anywhere they else. Take their I mean, what? And dying and seal them in secret caves. <gasps> Whatever for? Were the dead going to rise from the grave? No, not no. as such. It's more the bodies would just disappear and what oh the writing's kind of vague sadly all i know is they had a rash of vanishing corpses i hate when that happens long as they were exposed well, heck even if they buried them in the sand the body wouldn't be there the next day hmm. though some of the time there'd be a little left just a few bones you think they could like stake some people out to watch them I'm getting a chill hmm. just thinking about it and the fire's You're gone out. the chill because the fire's gone out. We should oh, you're right. maybe do something uh, about that. Hey, buddy, would you mind picking up some firewood? It's over by the mill. <laughs> I don't know, man. The music's getting pretty ominous. You want to come with? Gramble, Wambus, Triffany. I don't trust Wiggle and uh, Bafika, but, you know. I also don't know where the fucking mill is. Uh, Music's ominous as all get out. Oh, here it is. Okay. Just grab some firewood, yeah. Nothing nothing untoward here. They're all go oh no, they're fine. Okay, where were we? Um Really thought something was gonna happen there. You were saying something about the zombies? No, no zombies. Listen, spooky as the disappearing stiffs may be, that's just a story. It's I just a guy about. harvesting organs. It's fine. I'm more worried about the living. The Memories! Living? Obviously, we're not the first Grumpuses to make it to Snack Tooth. So what makes us think all the others are dead? All the skeletons. I've seen those chewed up skeletons around the island. We all know something kills Grumpuses out there, and it has teeth. Bug Snacks don't have teeth. And like Wiggle said, there aren't animals out here other than us. She's not wrong about the Borns. Borns. Ah, ah. Uh, time out. I gotta use a little grump shrimp. Now hold on. You saying grumpuses turn cannibal? That's ridiculous. We ain't got the stomachs for it. Floofty eats grumpus. <laughs> no way that's true. Who the hell's oh, Floofty? It's true. Late one night, I saw Floofty dragging something along the beach. When I got closer, I saw what it was a severed leg. Damn. And as I watched, they held it up to their mouth. And then, they took a bite out of it. Uh, don't mess with my head, Beth. You're gonna scare me snackless. Ah, dog grump. Uh. Is somebody gonna check on Philbo? Nah, nah, see. 
he had Taco Bell. That just happens. He, he's fine. He's fine. So anyway, this leg and who the hell's Floofty, huh? They sound interesting. No, me, huh? Okay. I, I mean, I got the firewood. I don't know why I have to do this, too. Uh. Sounds like someone's having a good time. Yo, Philbo! Oh, hey, buddy. Uh, sorry, I, uh, I got a little too spooked, and, and I came here to calm down. So then... Huh? I, I don't know what you're talking about, buddy. Are you feeling okay? You look like you've seen a ghost. <laughs> well, uh, let's keep it together and get back. Well, then. Are you? Uh... Well, they have toilet paper, at least. Eh, like, I have toilet paper. ha -sha! I'm hilarious. You got pranked! Alright, I've calmed down. I've done a bit of pranking. Sorry about that. What I miss? Can we just quit it with the spooky stuff? I don't think I could get any sleep. Darling, calm yourself. For I know what lurks in the I know this is a horror game. I mean, there's body it's horror. The queen of bug snacks. How did you do that without a your bug banjo? snack bigger than any we've ever seen. And how are you doing this without a microphone? Well, there's the banjo. She conducts this delicious orchestra, bringing music to our mouths. And once we're dancing to her tune, she gobbles us up. That's precisely right, darling. This story makes no sense. Why would Bug Snacks have a monarchy? I mean, oh, wham! This is just the title. Butterflies and queens do, right? Big enough to eclipse the moon. What else would you call that? Um, a hallucination. Believe what you will, Wambus. For I know Memories. I have seen. Regardless of what sort of monster you believe in, something. He's looking out there. I'll give her this. She's a talented it's vocalist. Only a matter of time before like, we're outside. Comes. She's got reverb. That takes talent. She's also harmonizing with herself. Grumpin' Snacks, it's coming for us. Oh, oh that could be anything. Yeah, yeah. Right, calm down. Get No need to freak out. It's probably just a uh, uh, something safe. It's I'm probably something out, safe. I'm not getting eaten by some monster or floofty just because you won't admit you're scared. Don't worry, Gramble. We'll go check it out. If something goes wrong, sacrifice Bilbo first. Oh, absolutely. All right. What the hell was all that? Well, the mill got knocked over. Well, part of the really just the the saw on the table. Millhouse. <laughs> My god, okay, well. It burst on through? Apparently it did. Yeah, uh oh. Perhaps I'm reading too much into it. There's planks out here, which means it burst in from out here forward. Ah, uh, but you see, there's planks in here, which means it burst. Through here and knocked these down. Get the fuck out of my way, Philbo. Oh. Hey, who's this dude? Chandlo? Whoa, it's Philbo. And somebody new? Hey, how are you? Doing better these days, yeah. More than halfway getting, getting to request something stupid. What about something it's... not stupid? How close are you I to saw that? The fire and I thought, whoa. Snacksburg's on fire, so I came down here to check on it. 
Then I remembered I left some stuff at the mill, so here I am. Is Shelda around? Oh, no. Nobody's seen Shelda since the, uh, the, the fight. Major bummer, bro. I could use her wisdom right now. Anyway, can't stay and hang. I gotta get all this stuff back to Snorpy right away. You know how he gets. Don't you at least want to say hi to everybody? Ah, uh, if I do that, they're gonna want me to stay. Catch you later, bros! But, but I do want you to stay! Who brought the dude, bro? Oh well, let's get back and tell the others. Why is he on the island? I guess we'll find out when I inevitably interview him, eh? This guy's great. Seems a little uh, out of it right now. Like a hundred miles folks. away, sort of out of I'm it. I'm fine. <laughs> you shot your sash. Um, I carried oh, off all surfing. Just <laughs> oh, that's a relief. So that settles it. Things are good and safe and boring. But wait, what if Chandler was the queen of bug snacks? Oh my god! He doesn't have the grace required for royalty. Oh, okay. Yeah, if anybody's queen around here, <sighs> it's me. How she you spelled know, it. The desert grumps had a history of matriarchal leadership. Real fascinating system they had. Every year, Based. the ladies would go hunting, and the one to bring home the biggest bug snack was the new head honcho. Based. Hello, Tiffany. Guess that's that then. Yo, it's true. Men are stupid. All right. Give us like something shiny to look at and go do all the hard work, ladies. We're having fun frolicking. You go build society. That's what I want. To be free of responsibility and to stay home all day. While women go and make money and do the hard work. That's feminism. And I see no reason to alter that system in any way. Feminism, the secret male plot to make all the women do the hard work Hi. while they get to stay home looking pretty and playing video games. Would you stop taking photos of me, you freak? Anyway. Uh, crap. That did not open up as far as I know any new areas unless the mills got something. Oh, shit, it did. All right, well, fuck yeah, let's go. To Sugar Pine Woods. Rain or a little bit of snow? Uh... Hanabi! These snacks uh, stick to just about anything, including traps. Oh. Well, I've got an idea then. Hold on. I was trying to finagle this uh, with a sandwich. Whoops, uh, right, aim. There we go. I see right there. Well, I might have jumped the gun on that one. Also, what are you? Oh, shit! So fast evades capture must be a way to trip it. I mean, yeah, there is, right? It's gotta be like, just put this in its path. Whoopang! Oh wow, gets right back up, interesting. Oh, you're new. What are you? Peanut butter. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go. Alright, so if I put you here, and then I aim you there. Whoop ha! Oh, that was it, too. Nailed it. A quookie. And I have 25 unique species of bug snacks captured. Hell yeah. Let's go. 
Now let's take a proper look around this place. Ah, it's Chandlow. I believe your name is. Snorpy? Snorpy! Bro, Snorpy, get out here! Isn't Snorpy one of the name of the uh I'm sorry, Chandler, banana I'm not splits? <laughs> this guy's I'm voice. This close to finishing my next invention. Return to your lifting in peace. <laughs> Snorpy, we talked about this, bro. You gotta go outside at least one hour a day. <laughs> gotta get some fresh air, dog. It's true. What I'll get is the attention of the Grumpinati. Who? There's nobody out here but us, bro. Better to work in the shadows where I cannot be seen. Also, it's cold out there. Bro, if you're not coming outside, I'm bringing the outside to you. No, what? You cannot lift my entire house. Oh, yes, I can. I'll oh, damn. I'll lift your crib, dog. <laughs> I won't lift, Not lift your my crib, crib. Tableau. I have delicate instruments in here and... Lift in your crib, dog. There, I'm out in the fresh air. I can smell the chemtrails. <sighs> That's right, bro. One step at a time. Then he was right back inside. Well, at least his door's open, right? Howdy, we met back in town. Whoa, it's you again. How's that sweet mountain air Not treating you, bro? Trails. It's easy to stay swollen in paradise. Easy for me, anyway. I'm Chandlow Funkbun. Hell yeah. Lift him and lift him. <laughs> I got the full package. You feel me? Uh, want to come back to Snacksburg? Nah, I'm good. I mean, I like being in town, but it gives Snorpy mad anxiety. Why don't you talk to him? He's not good with strangers, so tell him I sent you. <laughs> All right, so get hooked. Uh, Chandlow's not coming back unless I can get Snorpy to come back. One of your legs appears to be a Cinnabon. Would you care to explain that, sir? Oh, he's got a little thing of honey. And it's like a, I guess it's meant to be those bears of honey, but it's like a kind of a meditating dude of honey. Also, who's bringing these guys newspapers? Lasagna sales rising, record breaking Monday. Stock market is okay. And Steve Grumpo weighs in. Oh, well, thank goodness Steve Grumpo's weighing in on this lasagna increase. Oh, and who could forget cryptid spotted downtown? Uh, and those are just letters. Consector adipiciding elit said, which backwards is a uh, destile gnicus piliad rudekesnock. So you know, I hope that cleared that up. Mayor of New Grump City News Flash. Uh, the Grumpa Nutty. What is this? Snorpy's Conspiracy Board. He's managed to fit every single conspiracy into one paranoid blob. Grumpa Nutty. Other things. It would be larger, but I ran out of red string. Well, that is the important thing. Red Strings Club would be fun to play. It's been a minute since I touched that one. Oh, he did, did he? My poor sweet Chandler has always been too trusting. Chandler is your business with Oh, me. Preston and Chandler. Well, clearly Chandler was named for the Friends character. Don't know about Preston. I uh, want to come back to Snacksburg. Hmm. I'm not disinterested, but you're a still a suspicious individual. I propose a test. Okay. Yeah. Take my newest invention, the Snack Grappler. Ooh. I built it so that I could help Chandler with his basketballing problem. Basketball but I problem? That meant Hell going yeah. outside, so you do it, and then maybe we'll talk. You telling me Chanlo and I can do some mad dunks? Do you have arms? What's going what's what's, up, what's going on with you? Like I can see you've got one arm, but you keep following me around the room. I wish you'd like have an idle animation. Ah oh, well. Yo! Nice dog! I knew he'd warm up to you. Alright, follow me. I got the snack grappler, which is this thing. 
Oh, I bet this is how I get the... Well, it's definitely how I get the olives out of the air, but, uh... I bet this is also how I get those sandwiches apart. I think I see the problem. How do you have so many bass... What is your deal, dude? Oh! Check it out. My own personal dunk zone. That's my Problem Discord. Is, Everyone dunks I on lost me. lost my balls. <laughs> They're stuck all over the place. Yo, Sam. I'm sure I could get them down without your help, but... Snorpy made that grapple thing for me, and I want to see it in action. That's fair. And can I just... Alright, what's your deal? Slow and Sticky likes to stay far out of reach. Loves chocolate. I do have some chocolate. I'm hoping that like sends it into a frenzy or something. Hmm. Anyway. Oh, can I make a sweet dunk? Hold on. Make a sick basket. Nailed it. Thank you, thank you. I am the greatest. What is this? Hold on. Ow! Okay. <laughs> Hit me in the face. I mean... Is that all? I got three of them for you. Is that it? Oh, wait. Put them in the back. Oh, I see. I have to shoot them. They don't count until they're in the basket. Now, I could just do this, but that's the sissy baby easy way to do it. So you gotta score those sweet dunks. They aren't dunks. Alright, alright, alright. And there it goes. Nailed it. Everyone dunks on me everywhere. It's true. All Even right, on my fake my birthday. Back. That grapple thing is awesome. I bet it can grab all kinds of stuff. Snorpy's a genius, bro. Check it out. There's a cine snail right over there. I know it looks like a sticky dump truck full of carbs, <laughs> but it's actually a sticky dump truck full of carbs is what I like to see on the ladies. Am I right? Huh? Why is everyone leaving? Guys, I'm so lonely. Master climber, even I can't keep up with it. I always wanted to climb like that. Hey, see if you can catch me that sin of snail, bro. Well, I mean, I tried, didn't work. So the only thing I can think is, let me set this up. Uh huh. I'll deploy it. The aim will go over there. I'll put you on here. I will launch. Grapple. And then I will Let's grab. Drop, Oop. Dog. Grapple it. Excellent. 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 All according to plan. The scene is snail. Anyway, uh, your hand. Bro. Bro. Oh, yeah. I feel stronger already. You shouldn't. Watch me vert climb right out of here. Race you back to the cabin. Okay, you son of a... Oh. Oh, no. No. He's gonna beat me. It also doesn't help that this launcher fucking sucks. It gets up there and then I step on it and they're like, ah, it's too much weight. It also occurs to me it may have gone the wrong way. This opened for a reason. Then again, uh, maybe it didn't. Unless I can grapple you. Uh, oh, he beat me. He so beat me. I have escaped the dunk zone. I really hate the, 
the jump pad loses, you can aim it, but as soon as you step on it, it's like, well, that's too much weight, so now it only goes this far. I hate that. Nice, you made it. You got it makes sense, but I hate it. Me, I got the same time I always get. I guess one bug snack isn't enough to push my limits. There's gotta be more cinnabuns around this mountain, dog. Wouldn't it make you weaker? Cause like now your arm is cinnabun. I need to feed him two cinna snails. All right. Ah! Oh, and they got pillows here and everything. That's cute. What if I can just grab him? Nah. I mean, I already have these things, but I want to know how to catch them properly. Although, I guess maybe what I did was catching them properly, since I already have them, eh? If I were Sinus Snails, where would I hide? Hmm. Maybe up there? No, but there does appear to be some sort of plunger in there. Oh! Uh... Okay then. Sure! I just got that, I guess. Uh... Anyway... I don't think I was supposed to get that yet, if I'm being 100% honest with you. Where are these out? Cine snails. A video diary. Check my journal for clues. Hmm. Lisbert's old backpack, mayhaps. All right. Well then. Uh, sin a snail. Sin a snail. Sin. Sin a snail. Sin a snail. Difficult to say. Also sounds like it could be a Pokemon. I mean, surely, yeah, he's not just going to pop back up down here. But I'm wondering if I have to, like, go into a new area for it. All it said about them was they like to sit out of reach. So, I'm, like, checking the boundaries and the borders of what's obviously the level. I don't know what this is. Uh... A sign. There used to be an arrow there, I see. Oh, I found the bobsicle. Ow, oh, you bastard. Yeah, no. I don't suppose I can uh, trick you into heating up with some hot sauce. Bobsicle. No. Easy to stun, but I cannot stand the freezing. What are we? Oh, are you on fire? Hmm. Hey, come over here. Catch him, you fool! Catch him, too. Oh, wait, do I need... Hold on. Do I need... Oh, 
Oh, I see. He breaks. Fascinating. Okay, then. That happened. Uh, anyway, I'm looking for snails. Ah, bug snacks appear at night. Did the snails only come out at night, and that one was like a story-based one? Is that why I'm not seeing any? I guess maybe I could check my, uh... I have like a snackpedia or something like that. Uh, yeah. 88,000 calories, good lord. Very slow, like, stay out of reach. God, I can just do that, huh? That's dangerous. Uh, loves chocolate. Yeah, no, it, uh... Doesn't say when it's around is the problem. But the good news is I have two, uh, bobsicles whenever, uh, I get back to Cromdo. Where are these? Is that one? That might have been one, honestly. Hold on. Bobsicle. Oh, they're, why are they near his basketballs? What the hell? Uh, I also don't see how I'm going to get over there. So, you know the drill. Deploy. Aim. Not at you. You. There we go. And deploy. Launch. Activate. And snag. Excellent. Zeta snail. Hey, what up, dude? He's right, though. They do like to stay out of reach, it would seem. Oh, there's the other one. Kismet. Were you there before, or did you come out because it's like sunset or whatever? Anyway, hardly matters. Uh, deploy. Go to you. Get you on there. Moving in that action. What about a boo? I don't even need the. Okay, maybe I do need the claw. No, I don't. I can just walk right up. Uh, get rid of the spuddy. I don't need no spuddy. So this guy wants me to turn him into, like, a 100% cinnamon roll? Because, like, dude, that's not gonna... There's no sick gains to be had there. Whatever, though. Whoa. Whole arm. And lastly... One of your feet. Yeah. He's into it. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about! I can't wait to check my gains! Before yeah. that, I got a situation. Honeybees flew off with my backup balls. Now my balls are up in the sky. Hate when that happens. No you and giraffes have the same problem. Hi. Believe me, I've tried. You gotta be my wings, dog. Master that grabber. Catch me those honeybees. Oh, hey, about that. Uh, got these honeybees for you. Bro. Honeybee. <laughs> Whoa. Well, that kind of at least looks like now. Oh, got shoulder and oh, hand, but the the forearms literal power. twig. It's power. Bro, you really did me a solid. If you want me back in town, I'll be there. But. I ain't going anywhere without my main dog, Snorpy. Yo. He'd be lost without me. I can't get Snorpy to leave, though. Whatever's keeping him here, he doesn't want to talk to me about it. Says it's a secret project. But I got a feeling he'll talk to you. <laughs> I do get shit done. Ugh, I hate that you... Let me look at you. Whatever. Huh, Chandler said you had a secret project. Ah, yes. I wish I could tell Chandler everything, but knowing the truth would only put him in more danger. Anyway, you have my thanks for helping him. 
and I you, you after all. are cool with putting I me in danger. I am Fizzlebean, engineer and seeker of truths. Here, new chum, lean in chum. close so that I may bestow a hug on you. Ah. Ah, what an excellent hugging experience that was. We shall have to do that many more times. Now, I need your help. Are you willing to risk your life for the greater good? I would die for you. He definitely planted something on me. They're boyfriends? Ooh, maybe. Splendid! There is another device you will need. Oh. I've hidden it inside the Bug Watch Tower. Yeah, about Once that. Once you have it, I will tell you more. Ugh, one of those flying bug snacks has set off the tower's alarm system again. Although you seem to have avoided being trapped inside. Clever. All right, return to me for the next phase of the plan. Ah, chum, I have such a craving for cookies. Why, my craving is so terrible that I would like my teeth to be cookies, so that I may taste my own teeth, you see. Oh, do be aware that the trip shot cannot attach to snow, sand, or dirt. A minor design flaw, perhaps, but that's what I get for using suction cups instead of knives. I like the detail that he pulls I out a radio. A ruse, of course. The Grumpanati are using the cookies to trace my dental fillings. But if my teeth are cookies, the resulting counter signal will make my location untraceable. Yeah, he pulls out a radio. I wasn't meant to get that yet. He was absolutely meant to be talking to me over a radio, but he was right in front of me. Still had the radio animation, though. Not maybe they are. You're saying it, so it's true. Ah, well, all right. I can't argue with that. How many do I need? Oh, wait. I need to turn your teeth into cookies. I have a cookie. Do I just need the one? Boy, I am fucking killing it at this area. Oh, yeah, teeth. Ah! Splendid! I no longer have to worry about psychotronic torture or cavities. But now I hunger for charm mallows. Can't ever have enough charm mallows. <laughs> yeah, okay, so, um. Oh, okay, I need two. I was gonna say, I've got one. Charm mallows were. <laughs> some jams on! Uh, no, not now, Chadlow. The radio is... It's broken. Aw, oh, man. No jams with you and your boy? Alright, so how, how does this tripwire thing work? Can I just... I won't attach this bug snack. Do I... Let me get a picture of you. Okay, now then you... Is the idea it crashes into the tripwire and then I just grab you? Did you get the tripwire? Yes, I see. I got it ahead of time. I found a jump pad, got up there, clawed it out, and then I didn't know what to do with it. And then he's like, go get it, and I had it right in front of him the whole time. But I seem to get the hang of it. It's literally a launchable tripwire. Most people do get that early. Yeah, I just stood on the jump pad, went up there, saw a thing in the room, and grappled it out. It was right that. But it does seem like it's just a tripwire you can set up. Anyway, uh, yeah, I got some charm atlas for you. What am I doing? Just feeding you two. Okay. Uh, your nose. <laughs> And your head! <laughs> Ridiculous. I'm sorry about your With hat. With that blind spot in place, I can safely return to Snacksburg. Meet me outside. Okay. Hmm. This guy seems cleared of danger. That's the thing that makes the centipede super easy. Oh, I figured it was the grapple thing, so you could just grab Snorpy's it and pull. Snorpy's ready to go? All right, dog, let's do this! In just a moment, Chandlo. You've been an invaluable ally. I'm even tempted to call you a friend, but quietly, so I'm not overheard. Mm. Bro, if I didn't think it'd crush you like a tin can, I would hug the grump out of you. Oh, what the grump? Here it comes! 
you. What expert hugging that is, you do that hug. Maybe he's just weird about hugs. All right, let's get out of here. Race you back to town, Snorp Dog. No, please don't make me run with you, Chandlo. I'll go weak in the knees. If you're not up for it, I could always carry you. No, no. Blushing intensifies. Right. You're lost. Oh my God, they See were robots. Chandlo. All right, well, I got both of them back. I guess I got to go back to town. I'll check. Oh, I got to interview them. Hell yeah. And then uh, I can go get those sub sandipedes. Bye, fans. I mean, it seems like Snorpy's crushed out. And I mean, can you blame him? Chandlow's a fit looking guy. Uh, let's see. Here we go. Bro, come check this out! Philbo told me you were living here, and I thought, you know what this place needs? Walls! I actually prefer the airship. It's my bad for not finishing it in the first place, though. I was gonna have it ready in time for you, but then all that stuff happened. That's crazy. But I prefer or later, the airship. Chandlo gets the job done! Enjoy your walls, dog! That's great. I prefer the airship. Also, what is this? Map of Snack Tooth. Oh. Kind of weird being back to Civilization app all the same. Feel free to stop by and chat. Oh, it's like decoration. I see. Anyway. Interview! Ooh, did I get the Bob Skull? I sure did. I'll crush your questions! I had to have it stand near a Charmello, and then it like split into two, and I was able to get him. So I could also go back to Cromdo. Uh, so anyway, let's start with who are you? Chandlo Funk Bun, I lift. Funk Bun, hell yeah, he lifts, brother. Mr. Funk Bun to the unenlightened. This drinks for you, Funk Bun. I love that his name is C. Funk Bun. Ah, tastes rummy. Anyway, lifting is a job, brother, you know it is. But if you love what you do, you never work a day in your life. Am I right? That's why I'm constantly it's working. Way of life, bro. Anything that needs to go up. Logs, buildings, balls, snorkey. Eh. I'll get what? in there. If I want to push my limits, I got to go somewhere extreme. I heard nobody he funks comes back buns. From this island. Sounds I like guess, a challenge yeah. to me. Ah, so you're here for the adrenaline. Hey, I'm always looking out for Snorpy. I know roughing it isn't his style, but there's no way I was coming here without him. Uh, how'd you two become a thing? I don't know what you mean, dog. We're like the sky and the sea. Been together since the dawn of time. Yeah, they're fucking. Bug snacks are strong, like a primal kind of strong. Like they own this place, and I gotta respect that. And why'd you leave town? Oh, Snacksburg was a disaster without Lizbert. I couldn't stop all the fighting with lifting or wisdom. I mean, you're out of ideas at that point. I gotta keep things chill for Snorpy. He's got a lot of that social anxiety. Any info on Liz? Lizbert is top dog. You feel me? She really inspires me to test my limits. But, uh, that's about it. I'm really tighter with Egabel. Okay, can you tell me about Egabel? Yeah. Egabel's a sweetie. She was always looking out for me. Showed me how to stay safe while still pushing my limits. But she was always pushing herself way harder. She was working out? Yeah. She asked me to train her. Surprised the grump out of me, because... She really wasn't built for that kind of stuff. We'd go running every morning and lifting after lunch. Though she would get real down on herself sometimes. But she never gave up, and I respect that. Huh. And what happened to them? I wish I could tell you. Those two were strong together. I can't think of anything that could take them down. They gotta be okay out there. Somewhere. Thanks, Chandler. 
You really slam dunked Bro, that interview. That's not. Just don't. Yeah, okay. Anyway, I recorded. Egg Keep Bell's to my wheelhouse. While we were working out. She shared some pretty private stuff. But maybe it'll help you bring her back to us. Don't let me down, bro. Oh, shit, the key. Hell yeah. I also found a film reel that I want to observe. Yeah, this dude lives in a lumber mill, which I'm so jealous of. I love the, uh... Oh, hey, shit, it's this guy. Uh, and his board. I love the, uh... I love this floor plan where it's kind of like a loft like this and it's open air. Just mills. I don't know what it is. Like a windmill, a lumber mill. Uh, I always like... I like a building that's also, like... One floor is, like, it's your bedroom, and another floor is your job. I don't know. I always like that. But the job is simple. You don't have to travel far, and people don't come bothering you with stupid requests. And also, you don't have well, any co-workers. Are you mad? I can't have my secrets plastered all over the front page news. Put me in a lighthouse, is what I'm saying. Uh, what if your name wasn't attached? Hmm. I suppose I can reveal a tad bit, so long as my identity is Mixed protected. Mixed-use solidarity living quarters? Is that what they're called? I like clock towers, lighthouses, uh, windmills, lumber mills, things like that. <laughs> All right, who are you? <clears throat> I am Snorp Redacted. <laughs> I have devoted my life to- Yo, how'd you do that? To foil the machinations of the Grumpinati. That was a cool trick. Why are you here? I was dragged here by my dearest friend, Chan- Redacted. <laughs> he thought I needed some fresh air or something. Much as I hate the outdoors, I simply can't say no to him. Aw, boyfriends. How long have you and Redacted been in a relationship? Well, I, well, I, I, I mean, we've been together since kindergarten. Ooh. It would make perfect sense if we were together together. Mm. He's never- Said we are, has he? Oh, he's got a little crush, but it's not official. Or he's got a huge crush, and it's not official. Probably that one. Mixed use is what it's called, where part of it is used for a job and part of it's used for a living. I mean, assuming you could live in a clock tower, everything I named tracks, lighthouse, lumber mill, and windmill. I surmise they are some sort of synthetic life form designed to beguile our taste buds. I even don't mind like a bed over a shop. I'm so glad you asked. I believe there may be a factory located on this very island, hidden somewhere deep underground. Right. I have charts. Let me show you my charts later. Of course. That was about where did the artificial bug snacks come from? Sure. But yeah, no, uh... A bed over a shop is like a cop-out, but, you know. Uh, it's still at least better than nothing. Chandler thinks they're dating and Snorpy thinks it's a one-sided crush. Aw. I was too exposed. Floofty tried to wrap Ellie's me up in their back. experiments, now that Lizbert and Agabel weren't around to occupy them. I could see that this was the next step in the Grumpinati's plot against me. You think Floofty is part of the Grumpinati? Which I'm going to assume is the Illuminati. Lizbert disappears, we are hit with an earthquake, we suffer a snack shortage, all that in one day. That was one day, really Jesus. Think those are all coincidences. The timeline is on my charts. That's completely unrelated, of course. Elizabeth Megafig was a curious sort, and had a foolish bone in her body. You're fat, same brother. She could rival me in wits, and chat. Redacted. <laughs> the redacted. We would share secrets now and again. Dreadful... Terrible secrets. So many dicks in chat now, so happy. What? Ellie, you alright? You got fucking something on your mind? Ellie, please, this is not the place for it. It's after hours, sure, but come on now. What terrible secrets? <laughs> I'm not telling you the terrible secrets because they are terrible and secret. That tracks. I think we're done here. Excellent interrogation, chum. So great that you deserve another hugging experience. Ah. 
<laughs> hey, this must not go on the record. Elizabeth Megafi discovered something on the island that came to me for help. I see. An entrance to the underground, locked behind a strange device. I assisted her in unraveling its secrets, and soon after, she vanished. Oh. You must take extreme caution. I can tell you where to find it, but the rest is up to you. I see. Snorpy gave me a map to a mystery door. And that could be recorded, so that was the hugging. Okay, fair enough. Ugh. This is HBO After Dark. Yo, exactly. You're not all right? You're dying of embarrassment? No, it's fine. Hey, listen. Sometimes we just got dick on the brain, all right? I've had I'm sorry autocorrects to I'm dirty. I'm sorry to I'm dirty before without noticing it. Yo, take a shower then, God. <sighs> Ellie, it's fine. I'm more surprised Automod didn't catch it. Why do you have a two present next to your name? Uh, because you are, seven nine is the number one gifted subber this month. So he, if he would t uh, type anything, he would have a gold present with a one next to his name. You are the number two gifted subber uh, this month. So you have a silver present with a two next to your name. Uh, right. I want to get these sandwiches. Honestly, like, it for the body horror, I probably wouldn't eat bug snacks until the sandwiches showed up. And then I'd be like, I mean... It's a sandwich, right? Like, fucking... <laughs> How can I say no to a sandwich? Anyway. I also gotta hit up Cromdo uh, and get him back to the village with his popsicle feet. Nathan, you're unbanned. And hydrate? Well, if you if you insist, I do have this rum. Mmm. Hydrating. Just wanted to throw money at tokens sometimes. Yo, appreciate it. Have you seen the calorie amount in some of those snacks? Yeah, no, I, um, when I was trying to find the, uh, I forget how I opened this fucking book. There it is. When I was trying to find the, um, uh, it doesn't say, uh, oh, it does down here. I was trying to find these. I noticed it was 88,000 calories, which is insane. 26.8 is wild. 50, 5,300 is like... Uh, you that could la you could eat just that and it would be a whole day. That's that's your food for the day. You're in horny jail because Automod hates egghead. It denied the word egghead. What? Yeah, I'll allow that. What the fuck? Thanks for the feedback. Yeah, egghead is fine. What do you mean? I wonder what the least calories is. 4,100 for a Bopsicle. Uh, uh, 2,000 for Green Peel Bug. Nothing wrong with that. 2,000's a uh, honestly reasonable amount. 100 for a Poptic. That's probably the least amount. These things all have a bit of uranium in them. Charming. The most so far is the uh, Snail at 88,000. Uh... 11,000. Ooh, 330. 430. Some of these are reasonable. 31. Jeez. 400. Yeah, the 100 for the pop tick is reasonable. 88,000 for the fucking cinnamon roll snail is expected, I suppose, but. It's still wild. Automod's wild. Automod's a fucking weirdo. It's true. Oh yeah, where's this sandwich now? There you are. I'll just deploy... Right. Um. If it's red, I can't deploy it. 
Okay, there we go. That's weird. Uh, will that get it? Has to be on a wall. Uh, Grumps does have super high metabolism. I see. You have new cups, Pog. Yo, isn't being an adult sad that that's like... Yo, hell yeah, new cups. You did. Catch the bastards! Is that all of them? Oh, no! Got it. All right. Nailed them. Now then, uh, back to Snackburg. Then I'll check in on... Oh, I gotta watch these videos is what I gotta do. Uh, Snackburg. Recently not new dishes. It's, uh, ooh, they're the fancy McDonald's cups. Hell yeah. The collect, oh, the collection cups. Hell yeah. I've seen those. Lead free. Uh, you know. Oh, now you have something you want to do? Ugh, one at a time, please. I can ignore the mailbox at least. Aloha. Let's eat. I got some sandwiches. You want the sub ones in particular. Uh, it's weird only your left horn I can change. Whatever. Uh, arm. <laughs> it's like you've got your arm sticking out of a sandwich, which is pretty funny. Stand up. I'm being honest with you. Uh, nose. What up, sandwich nose? I can feel the harmony building. You have old school Disney me. McDonald's cups from the early 2000s. But I'm still the paint on those has got to be like fucking I'm gone. I'm sure this seems excessive, but it's just, it's the, it's the creative process. The old McDonald's cups had lead paint. Do you awesome. know how I wrote? Hey Nathan, uh, concerning. Yeah, it sounds like they might be lead-based paint, Nathan. Maybe you shouldn't put your food near them, or beverages, I guess. You have cinnamon nuts? Hell yeah, let's go. Uh, hard work and practice? I stumbled into the studio two hours late. Mood. I hadn't slept in five days. Mood. And I was holding a banjo for some reason. Mood. I couldn't remember my own name. Mood. That's what I was going to sing. So in my haze, I just made it up on the spot. Me streaming. Two weeks later, I had a platinum record, and apparently I'd invented banjo pop. I would Needless listen to, to that. Say, it's been a hard act to follow. Good banjo, like Earl Scruggs and Steve Martin, sounds fucking great. Like, if you can, like, actually whittle on a banjo and make it sound good, that's legitimately really impressive. But it's so easy to be kind of dog shit on a uh, banjo, unfortunately. Butter toffee nuts. Toffee. Butter toffee nuts. Hell yeah. Random glass plates seem dope as hell. Do I have anything left over from like... I got some old McDonald's toys kicking around. Maybe they were Burger King toys, but... Uh, I specifically have... Whoever did Pokemon toys, I have tops. Like, I have a Chansey and a Clefairy uh, spinning top. Like, you put it on the side, spin, and put it, and they just go round and round and round. Uh, yeah, I got a, I got a Clefairy and a Chansey of those. This is back when it was just 151. Oh, and I guess also I have, um, uh, from Wendy's of all things. It's like a, a plastic case with a Charizard on it to keep Pokemon cards. I kept the Gen 3 Tops Pokemon cards because they were so different on them. They weren't like part of the trading card game. They were just like info about the Pokemon. I really liked those cards. They were cool. I uh, I never got more than like two dozen of them, but the tops Gen Three Pokemon cards I really really liked because it was just it was literally collect the card. There was no gameplay attached to it. I should see if I can get like a complete set of those or something, or like uh, at the very least a Makohita since I love that dude. They're from Coraline, yeah. I assume you meant Cor or Corel. No, huh? I thought it, you were gonna say Coraline. Bananas are radioactive? Yeah, barely. That's like saying apples are poisonous. Yes, they have a little bit of cyanide in them, but not enough that it matters. 
Anyway, let's eat, buddy. Specifically, I need to make your legs bopsicles. Which is a shame, because I already turned your legs into things. There you go. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Sweet relief. These things better not melt off. Anyway, don't cherries have side in them? I think so. Is yours. But again, it's not enough to, uh, it's not enough to matter. Coraline, Corral, same thing. I don't fucking care. Anyway, go back to oh, Bugs. and so you know, Crumdomart is not responsible for any loss or injury suffered as a result of the use of its products. Heck, he really... If you need anything I mean, he's else, not at all, Danny DeVito, please, obviously. Please, please, call your friend Crumdo. Oh, he's obviously not... Too hot, too hot. <laughs> it is much too hot in the desert. Again, obviously not Danny DeVito, but he really does sound like him. Or at the very least, and I mean, Phil from Hercules does sound like Danny DeVito, because he's not really doing much of a voice, it's just his voice. But, um... Yeah, it is... It's clearly like a DeVito-esque, uh... voice they have him doing. Anyone seen young Danny DeVito in things, like in Taxi, or, um... L.A. Confidential, or One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest? Young Danny DeVito is so interesting because, like, he's the same shape and has roughly the same amount of hair, but his skin is, like, so youthful and not wrinkled. It's really weird. He, he looks like just a young man who happens to look like that. He's not the iconic, you know, wrinkled face, glasses Danny DeVito that we all know and love. Perfect. To what do I owe the honor? What's a stone um, fruit? I'm just curious what you think you're doing here. It's a colloquial name for like pits, like avocado pit, back in business, cherry baby. pit, etc. Don't act all innocent. If you start running scams again, I'll know. Yeah, yeah, cause you know everything. And here's what I know: you're not better than me. Yeah, yet. peach and plum or other. Nobody examples. likes all you snooping around. <laughs> I don't care what they think about me, as long as I make sure you get what you deserve. Don't I always? Are you gonna buy something or what? Yeah, I'll take a tall snack water extra fizz. Coming right up. Us being the guys from math questions for cyanide? I have no idea what any of that meant. Anyway, let's interview you and then I'll talk to Philbo here. Oh, no, I'm gonna talk to, um, Wambus. And then Philbo, I guess. You wanna eat the fruit of a nightstand? Hey, how about an interview? All right, I could use some practice. They'll be interviewing me every day when I'm a gazillionaire. <laughs> mm. World's first gazillionaire. You know what? If it's Danny DeVito Grumpus here, I'm okay with it. Potatoes are nightshade. Potatoes are fucking wild. Literally, when you harvest a potato, that is the time to eat a potato. Any other time, and it is poisonous. Potato seeds, poison. Sapling, poison. Spud? Great. Harvest. Go for it. Sprouting? Poison. Don't do it. Weird how versatile they are and how deadly they are for most of their life cycle. <laughs> Who are you? Pota potatoes and eggs are like the two most versatile things. You can do pretty much anything with them and they'll still taste good. Brrr Business King, Sales Savant, future CEO of Starbucks, the eh. one, the only, Cromdo Face! Your name is Cromdo Face? You ever smell the future, kid? Huh? I can tell you, Lisbeth stank of opportunity. She came on TV talking big about this new superfood, and I wanted in. So I quit my dead end job and followed that stench of possibility. Yo, goals. Just know you'll never remarry. Oh, I mean, if anything ever happened to my wife, the only way I'd remarry uh, is if my wife came back to me and said, hey, listen, have you fixed whatever it is that made me leave in the first place? Because that's, that's the only scenario. She leaves me because she got smart and then comes back hoping I've improved in some way. And I won't, but if I'm lucky, she'll see past that. Uh, I used to go door to door selling gruel to I'll grandmas. I'll lonely forever. You're married. What do you mean? 
Anyway. Oh, sorry. What was your dead end job? I used to go door to door <laughs> selling gruel to grandmas. Paid on commission for grump's sake. Gruel to gr Why selling gruel? That's not going to happen. Out of like, well, during college, I guess, I almost got looped into a selling steak knife scam. What do I think of? Delicious, irresistible, marketable. They're going to catapult me straight to the top of money down, baby. Oh, yeah, Nightshade. I mean, not Cutco. <laughs> Listen, Fruit of the Nightshade. You almost got looped into selling vacuums. Oh, yeah, we've all been there. We've all been there. Uh, the reason I almost got looped into it is because a friend of mine uh, out of high school posted on Facebook that, like, he could refer people uh, to the job he was doing. And I was like, yeah, I could use some work. And uh, yeah, I was selling steak knives. And I'm like, you know what? I don't want to do this. I love you, Frank, but uh, I don't want to do this. <laughs> I don't want to be selling steak knives. You got scammed into buying pots and pans. Ah, rip. N nightshade isn't necessarily poison. Fruit of nightshade, I mean, isn't necessarily poison. I tried to make use of what Lisbeth didn't need anymore, and Befica didn't like that. Yeah, she went and told everyone that I'm a thief. What Befica did? Her? No. Gossiping? What? Crazy. I was salvaging. That's a community service, pal. Wow. But Befica planted evidence in my hut, said I stole her diary. So I did what any honest grump would do. I ran. <laughs> They prey on engaged couples planning their weddings. How, what a weirdly specific thing to prey upon. But that does kind of fucking suck. Glad I never heard anything about that while I was engaged. But to be fair, my engagement lasted like two years, three years. Uh, thank you, COVID. You drew that out. But no, eventually I got married. The ring to prove it. Dude, get me started. Everyone here thinks she's so great, such a fantastic leader. But I know the truth. She came here to stroke her ego and get Eggabel her fix. The rest of us were just pss, disposable. Her fix of what? That's Elizabeth. Remember, it's true. Nathan, Nathan was at my wedding. Push That's why he was unbanned. She abandoned us. Happened a lot of military bases. Oh, easy targets there clumped in one place with not a lot of like outside contacts because you got to spend a lot of time on bases. Yeah. That's why I told him to eat a tomato or a tomatillo or a bell pepper. Yeah. You married a year after we and we weren't really engaged. Well, he just woke up one day and said, hey, we've been, you know, hanging out long enough. Want to be married before common law sets in? And you both said yes. The most romantic of engagements, am I right? I, I gotta confess, I was thinking about sailing home after things got hairy. But when I went looking for our boat, it was gone. Hmm. There's only two grumps missing. You do the math. Hmm. Yeah, I bet Liz and Egg are living large in New Grump City by now. Interesting. Anyway, calm down, Cromdo. That's enough for now. Yeah, 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 yeah. I get it, pal. I'm not the nicest. Is everyone here my... but you married? I mean, uh, early Nathan's on, not married. Life is like a box of I don't think so. You always know what you're gonna <laughs> get. To rest. Sorry, laughing at Cromdo. That's a good line. Where the boat was. See what you think of Lizbert after that. God, everyone's giving me maps. Nathan's not married. I don't think 7 9 is. I don't think Jeppo is. I don't think Arg is. I don't think. Well, I know Noki's not. Uh, own name isn't. He's only like 17. Uh, I don't think Penguin is. Uh, no, it's it's shorter to list the people that are married, which is Kaida and I are married and Tim hey, and Ellie are pal. married. Oh, you have something you want, too. Let me talk to Wampus here doing? first. Nothing yet. think something might be wrong with the soil. Too dry or maybe too wet. Either way, something needs fixing. Why don't you fetch me a big old fibrous bug snack like a spuddy? I got a plan. It's set like a spuddy. Oh shit, I keep giving those away. God damn it. Well, at least they're easy to get. Um, you're the oldest one here to your knowledge. I think 
Noki and Kaida might be older than you, Tim. I forget how old you are. But no, lack of color, it sounds like the thing to do is find somebody in this chat and hook up with them. Since, you know, it seems to be working for at least a certain percentage of us. God, everyone has something they... Oh, for God's sakes. Want All something? Right. Yeah, what do you want? Hey, pal, I got a business opportunity for you. He's 33? Yeah, Noki and Kaida are older than you. treasure map while she was digging around. They say it'll lead to a huge bug stack. Imagine what a snack that size is worth. I was thinking of taking that map off her paws. That's where you come in. Get me a bug snack so delicious that Trifony would die You're turning 30 next week. I'm turning 30 in December. Then we'll split the profits 50-50. 50-15? Did you say 15? I clearly said 50. <laughs> <laughs> I like him. There's a certain, there's a certain je ne sais quoi to him. Although if you believe I have two birthdays a year for some insane reason, uh, I guess I'm turning 60 in December and I'm 59 now. At this point, I'm just picking hey up there. everybody's side quests. Darling, are you ready to help me top the charts? Yeah, what do you want? Triffany told me about a bug what? snack in the desert that only appears during the full moon. A creature in tune she just... with the cosmos. Never mind. Something that beautiful must also be significant, no? I mean, I guess. <sighs> Fly me to the moon and let me play among the stars. Rondo, I'm still bitter, by the way, that, um... Uh, Evangelion, when it finally got released on Netflix, took out Fly Me to the Moon over the credits. It doesn't change anything in the show, but like, Tiffany, what's going on? there was going? something cool about it being Fly Me to the Moon over the credits. But I'm bitter like that. How old's Noki? 34? 35? Around there. How old's Kaida? You thought I was the same age as her? Nah, Kaida and Noki are the same age. 34 or 35, roughly. One of those. I'm a good husband. I know their ages. I believe Kaida is 34. You have four birthdays a year. I don't know how you swung that. Can't recommend. I only have two as of recently, and it's not fun. But yeah, I'm 29. Turned 30 this year. Don't know your wife's birthday? I know my wife's birthday. Uh, and I can do some math. Yes, she's 34. Oh, not too bad. She's turning Actually, 35 this year. Helping me out here? She's robbing I cradle in my robbing grave. She's canyon. turning 35 it's, and I'm uh, turning 30. That's not a significant age difference. Bug snacks. I want to follow in the writer's footsteps. So uh, if it's not too much trouble, would you want to go exploring with me? We met when I was 20. All right, it's fine. Oh, you're too kind. The first place of note is in Falls. classic she joke, I see. Meet me there whenever's good for Corman, you. Corman, Navy, Marine, and regular birthday. True. All righty. What we're looking for is a big stone grumpus face and a bug snack called a pinkle. Let's look around. Oh, I mean, I have all the tools at this point. It j I just remembered. Oh, yeah, I can just rip the jar off the pinkle with this thing. As far as the face, I imagine it'll be in the cave. The cave that's like, first of all, give me that. Got that portion. Feed Triffany a pinkle. Uh, scan a stone grumpus. Okay, I assume the stone grumpus is through here. This little cave area, right? I mean, yeah, that's gotta be it. Evidence of ancient Grumpus activity. Did they live in this cave? Awesome, easy. And you can have this pinkle. You can, oh God, I don't want any part of you to be pickled because I wouldn't wish that upon anyone. Is your left leg. Oh, oh God, it's awful. 
Ugh. Oh, wow, that's a good one. You might have noticed pinkle statues scattered around here. These must have been an important food source to the ancient grumps. I found the stone, by the way. That there would be the You're gonna the eat her thigh? Yo, grumps. pretty hot. Civilization from over 5,000 years ago. All that's left but she is, is married, so, you know, maybe cool it. Mechanisms. Unlike the desert grumps, these folks didn't preserve their dead. In fact, the writer thinks they would sacrifice him to the bug snacks, like an offering to the gods and whatnot. Ooh. This means bug snacks may be a more lasting legacy than any of the stuff they built. Then again, her husband was banging a cactus for an indiscriminate period of time. So maybe Triffany's looking to, you know, broaden her horizons. The marriage appears to be open. Well, I was hoping to find a camp of some sort. Maybe a corpse or two. You know but what oh thigh well, you want to eat? It better be chicken. Spots to check out. Better be chicken. This is a PG stream. This is a PG stream, Tim. That better be a... Goddamn chicken thigh you're sinking your teeth into. We're all waiting. Ellie, lack of color, myself, beef. Okay, all right, fair enough. Fair enough. Let's not ask any more questions. Oh, she wants a white sheep hoof. I had one of those. I think I gave it to Grambus. Ah, oh, God, I wish I could... I understand it would completely go against his character, but I do kind of wish that, like, Grampus's farm acted as, like, a bank for bug snacks where I could just grab them from, grab them for later uh, once I needed them. But no, the point is I donate them rather than uh, have anyone else eat them. Hey, Ellie's on a three-stream streak. You love to see it. <laughs> Lack of color using the fake duck emote. One of the ones I'm most proud of for thinking of. <laughs> All of my stupid ducks, and then I threw in a real duck, and that one's called fake duck. <laughs> or is that one called real duck? I don't even remember my own. Oh, God. I went to, went to check. It occurs to me. Oh, that's the HD duck, of course. How silly of me. That's the HD duck. Uh, anyone else have side missions? I think Bafika had one. Oh, no, I keep meaning to look at these. Okay, hold on. Because I got video diaries. Day one, two, and four. Let's see them. I'm back in town after a narrow escape from a pack of vicious bug snacks. Turducken. Just in time for a gorgeous doctor to treat my grievous wound. Well, this gorgeous doctor thinks you're an idiot. Oh, Tech. Well, got her. And after I face those snacks, we need the duck emoji you. duck. Don't what, you want like a chibi duck? I don't, I don't know what you're asking. Me, but you are My duck colors kid? like that? Is that what you're asking? You're lucky it's such a shallow cut. And stop squirming around or I'll have to restrain you. <laughs> Nightbot straight up deleted in a lack of right. colors message. Hold on. Oh, because it was spamming. It look, be up and I see. Soon. No, you need to see yeah, it was too many ducks. Oh, Edgar Bill, you miss me that much? I just want you and can't help you there. Mission? That was spamming emotes. Uh, speaking of, you haven't seen the hall for my latest excursion. Ooh, did you bring me something good? You tell me. It's a brand new snack. Let you spam ducks. You got away with like twelve yes. of them. Just don't do fifteen. Stuck that turkey into an octopus? Turduck and I was with you until you got to the octopus. What's going on, Wiggle? Hello, darling. It was too many messages. Oh, it's also possible, yeah, Ellie's a mod, so she's allowed to spam. Uh, if you're not a mod, you don't get that privilege. Surprise! I'm back early! And have I got a story for you? Bill. Oh no, Bell! Ah, uh, Egg's going through a moment. Everything happened. 
Tiffany broke her leg. Gramble got food poisoning. I couldn't help both of them. Everybody was shouting at me. I didn't know what to do. I mean, the broken leg is more important. None of that's your fault. Also, What's yeah, the that. Point if I can't help anybody, I just sit here all day while everybody else is out there, all productive and happy. Well, this is grim. True. You help me all the time. Like when I cut my pool. You only got hurt because you were getting snacks for me. You'd be fine if I wasn't around. Don't say that. I need you, Bill. Nathan, how dare you have you a Pokemon emote that isn't Makuhita? You were there how could you? during the worst days of my life. Oh yeah, by the way, girlfriends. Like, I think that's canon at this point. They are partners. Agabelle and uh Lizbert. I know what'll make you feel better. Yeah. Thanks, Liz. I'd fall to pieces without you. That's been canon a while, yeah, so. Uh Chandlo and um the uh, not Floofty. Uh Chandlo and Redacted. Uh are at yeah, they could very easily be dating Snorpy. There you go. You have the LGBTQA plus representation in this game. I'm one of those. Okay, let her fly, and I'll show you my incredible aim. Clearly, it's the I L. To hit again. When you're finished with your amusements, come see me. We have work to do. Get out of here, Floofty. They're boyfriends. Floofty. Yeah. Um, What's wrong? Well, <laughs> one of them is boyfriends. The other one just has a crush. So remember. Bad. They're just passionate about science. Sure. Every time so you see the acronym, it gets longer. I heard about their experiment. <laughs> they did have to add the plus because it just kept getting longer. What's weird about it? I mean, look at you. How many bug snacks have you had? Hey, in my professional medical opinion, I am perfectly healthy. Hmm. We're all eating bug snacks and we're all fine. So are why you? are you getting on my case? I'm just worried, Bill. You're not acting like yourself. I'm not miserable. I found a way to make myself useful and happy to finally take some control over my life. And you're just upset because it doesn't involve you. Oh, wow. You don't need me anymore. Why were they filming this? Maybe I will. Why did they film that? Well, that was concerning. <laughs> Hello, darling. All right, what do people want me to do uh, before I? Philbo's got like the main quest. What do I want? Oh yeah, you need a white cheese poof. Oh, I gotta talk to Befica. Catch a spuddy. I have several of those, or had several of those. All right, I'll talk to Befica and then uh, I'll end the stream. I'm carrying on tomorrow. I like the game enough that I want to do the side quests before I continue on with the main quests. And again, the icon over his head Buddy? makes me think main quest. But also, like, I got the key to her diary, so I think that might be the main quest. Uh, but also, I don't see her diary all of a sudden. Oh, it might be in... Actually, when I think about it, uh, the diary might be in Bethika's place. No, where was Lisbeth's diary? I got the key for it, and I don't remember where the hell it goes. Oh, hi. Wambus and Triffany. It's definitely not in here. Also, where the hell is Befica? Oh. oh, she's just... You're just snooping in Philbo's place? Yeah, all right, sure. Why not? What's going on, girl? Hey there, bestie. We've got a new target. I'm Brando's sorry. Brando's back in... The term... Well, okay. The term full of bisexuals was blocked. Wild, yeah. And truly, it's because I was wild. Uh, <laughs> thank you so much, uh, BPG. Yeah, the term full of bisexuals was blocked by Automod. Don't know why. <laughs> Diary is by Triffany. Oh, in her tent. Yeah, that makes sense. Welcome to my life. Uh, say Scooby Doo, but replace every E O with an E. Skeeby D. Ah, oh, you got me. 
fucking, you took my Ohio. You Rizzler, you. Am I young yet? Do I sound like the kids? Welcome, BBG. Uh, unfortunately, we're just wrapping Down. up. I know that greedy but I'll be back tomorrow. Juicy dirt. I'm not talking about his pathetic little lies or scams either. I'm sure you'll find something good. Don't let me down, bestie. Oh, you want dirt on uh, Cromdo at midnight? You know what? I can, that one's quick. I can do that. Let me go to my bed and I'll just do that and then I'll wrap up. Egghead got blocked. Nah, egg. Egghead was blocked a few times, but much like Butt Plug, I think we've beaten Automod in submission to the point where it just allows it. Uh, midnight. Egghead got blocked. Yeah, Automod. The terms Automod decides to block are wild and varied. And, like, Egghead is one of them. For whatever reason. Alright, Cromdo, where are you going? What secrets have you, you son of a bitch? Hey, Grambus, what's up? Go on, Charwee. Just follow Papa's pointer. I have things or, or to no. do, Gramble. That's I didn't too. didn't actually. I didn't. Nope. We're off to a bit of a slow start. I gotta follow. It's so easy with Sprout. I just don't know what's going wrong now. Maybe, maybe Sprout can help. I'm sure he could show Charwee the ropes. What do you say? I mean, sure, but like I'm following Cromdo. Alrighty. Okay, well we're doing distract. this instead. Okay. Never mind. Sorry, Cromdo. Because I'm wild. Yeah. That's exactly why. Because I'm wild. Cromdo, get fucked. So many followers right at the end of the stream. Thank you so much. Accidentally sent a bad song. Great username. For following. Use the buggy ball to guide Charwee to the finish. Where's the finish? <laughs> I like that the entire town is seemingly okay with this. Ah, oh, there's a finisher right over there. You're, you're at the finish. You're right. You're right there. You are so at the finish. It's right there. Windows has turned nightlight mode on, so everything's gone yellow. I don't... Can I jump off? Oh. Nope. Okay. No, I can't. Uh, I mean, you're right there. I'm not 100% sure what you want me to do at this point. You can set it to not do that. I, well, was wondering why it went yellow. Yeah, nightlight's on. Uh, I can't do it right now. I'm trying to fucking finish this up. Unbelievable. I need Charwee following me. What, but, what does that mean? What do you mean I need Charwee? How did you get over the, never mind. Like, I'm trapped up here. We also have a big boost to our Discord. Oh, yeah. Feel free to subscribe on YouTube for all the VODs. Upload it as regularly as I can. Uh, and feel free to join the Discord. It's a place where people come to bully me and share memes. Such is life. Dragon. <laughs> Gotta get all the views. Thank you, Ellie being a, a good mod. Should be a little kiwi down there somewhere, cover the ball and sauce and get to follow you. Oh, I see how it is. I'm not just luring the ball, I'm guiding something. Yeah, the kiwi's at the fucking start. Okay. So what is the kiwi like? Chocolate can do. All right, let me do this and then that'll be, uh, that'll be the stream. All right. And, whoop. Yeah, go right there. Uh, I'll get you your chocolate. Yeah, now go.
It broke. Okay, well. Go, like, right there. Okay, it broke again. That's unfortunate. Go, like, right there. Right there. Excellent. It broke again. I'm not... Why do we keep breaking my ball? Is that 100% necessary, guys? Can you leave the ball be? Why? Why? What is wrong? Yo, Wiggle and Befica, fuck off. What are you two doing? Leave the ball alone. What is, what is your problem? Also, I don't know where it's going, but also, what is your fucking problem? Uh, this postman streams can be, yeah, well, there you go. They want the Strabby? Yeah, clearly. I... Can I just, like, put you there? Well, lead you forward a little bit. Then... Is that good enough for the, uh... Leave it alone, you hussy! Oh my god. Fuck. Miserable. I really just need to, like, get this stupid thing as close to the fucking finish line as I can. Ah, uh, this, this blows. <laughs> Why do they think this was a good idea? You're doing your job better than Nathan? Oh, yeah, absolutely. They, literally, Nathan, uh, worst mod. <laughs> That's why there's an entire channel point redemption to unban him. They just, maybe I, I set it up over here and I get the momentum going, but like, fuck man, Befica and Triffany are, not Triffany, uh, Wiggle are the worst. I'm also running out of chocolate, by the way. So I sure do hope they've got chocolate set up for this fucking thing. I hate. Oh good, they have chocolate set up for this thing. You're mad? Mine's bigger than yours? Yo. Problem I've had my whole life, am I right, fellas? Alright, this has got to be close enough that, like, I can slather it in chocolate and he'll come, right? Right? right. Well, not if I fucking miss. God, you're the, you are the worst. Triffany is somehow better than you at this. It's like right next to Triffany and she doesn't care. You run across the entire map. Mod battle will settle this now. Oh dear. I come in mods fight. It's good for interaction and chat. Unbelievable. Leave it alone! You fucking hussy. Oh, here comes Befica. Great. This kind of sucks. I just want to end the stream. I need to go to bed. I got work tomorrow. But, like, this mission kind of fucking blows. And the, the worst part is, I suspect it's entirely my fault. That's what really makes it stay. I suspect I'm... I suck, which is why this is the way it is. I mean, I guess that was on me. Can I just, like... Hold on. 
Yeah, go past them. Stop jumping over it and just land on the post, you fucking psycho. I'm out of chocolate. That's... Oh, hey, Lack of Color won. Congratulations, Lack of Color, for winning the Battle Royale. It did not settle who was better, no. But it was fun. And engaged viewers, at least. Uh, fucking... Yeah, there you go. Walk over there. Oh, we have to go around that way. Fair enough. Uh, I wonder if that was how I was supposed to do it. Like, just dumping chocolate. Wambus! Fucking move! I wonder if I was meant to just dump chocolate on the floor the whole time and I was being a dumbass. Kai's the best mod? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Even though you're in a battle royale, how to win? That's the beauty. Uh, you don't have to do anything. You, your uh, your avatar at the bottom does all the work. myself in sauce every morning just to get them to pay attention to me. But Hot, that's but just gross. Goes. You pour every little bit of love you got into somebody, and you just hope they notice. It's true. That's how my wife got me to notice her. It was a real, real fucking battle of ask me out already, you dumbass. To the point that she got sick of it and asked me out herself. Love you, babe. Anyway, that's going to be it for me, fucking finally. Good night, everybody. I uh, will see you tomorrow for more bug snacks. Thank you all for watching. Love you all. And be good people.